Ladies and gentlemen of the Twitch chat room and the YouTube comments, we are running a, a horror marathon. CVX, Silent Hill, Dino Crisis, RT Remake, Alien Isolation, Clock Tower, Silent Hill 2, and Granny 3. And let's hope that it actually works this time. I'm not going to skip this cutscene because I'm scared. Holy shit, that loaded fast. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's loading way faster than normal. It's crazy, dog. Okay, there. That's normal. There we go. Compile those shaders. Deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. Oof. These lines, though. It is running worse than normal for some reason. A lot of people are see through. A little worried. <laughs> It'll be fine. Thank you, Timba. Why are all you guys awake right now? This is supposed to be a dead stream. This is actually like a terrible stream time in general because in North America, everyone's asleep and in Europe, it's like five, six, seven. Why am I streaming this late? I had a... I'm trying to reset my schedule and... Oh. So I was going to stream way earlier today. But um, I only slept like four hours and I got up yesterday at like 5 p.m. And I'm just like, ah, I don't want to do a really bad stream. And so I decided just to sleep again. And I tried to sleep for really long. Like I kept going back to bed. I just want to... I want to have a more morning schedule again. Graveyard. Whew. Do I like the HD version better than regular CVX? Yeah, I mean, the only difference is it's HD. No bites yet. Oof. Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. I'm really rusty at this. Yikes. <laughs> Thank you, supers. 
The hardest. Thank you, Rakir, as well. Thank you. Let me live. Thank you, Rip. Um, the hardest part about this run is honestly not pressing action on the uh, notepad. Oh my god, these lines. Fuck, dude. Where's the music? I thought there was music here when this happened. What happened to the music? Oh my god, it's so bad. So I'm doing a glitched run because I don't know how to do glitches. I should learn glitchless. Um, but there's not much difference between the two categories. It's just uh, you dupe a few explosive crossbow rounds. You don't take the gun. That should feel good. Hey, body. Off we go. <sighs> Loggers. Okay, NTC0394. there was a glitch that made this a good RE game. Same. I'm just memeing. It's actually a good game when you watch the speedrun. Like, when you know how to play this game, it's a lot better than a blind playthrough. Just, it's really hard blind. I forgot. That needs to be a sub alert. I'm worried sick. Dude, my... Okay. My game is running like actual ass. It's very worrying. I'm afraid we won't be able to finish, but hopefully. Like, let's say I was attempting a PB right now. It just wouldn't fly. It's like that broken. Oh no. I'm also terrible as well. Where is my knife? Wait, wait, what? I thought... Wait, no, we had the knife. I had it with me. No, it's not in the security box. I took it. I took it. Wait. No, I put the knife back, I thought. Oh my god, I'm so bad. Was it not... Wait, 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 wait. Was it not... I'm not rewinding. It's okay. It's okay. Not too far away with door skip. Wait, wait, wait. No, this is crazy, dude.
Am I getting gaslit? I'm aware it's not in my inventory, but... Yeah, we all saw it. Okay, yeah, I guess I did. I guess I did. I guess I did. I guess I did. You bastard! I thought I had it with me. See. Yeah. Please don't Probably in here. Let's see. Metallic items you have in the security box. There it is. <laughs> I'm actually sort of glad it's in there because I legitimately thought it just disappeared from my inventory. Well, this is the worst Code Veronica marathon run I've done in years. That's okay. That's okay, guys. That's okay. That's okay. I'm sorry, I'm so distracted by the emulator's inconsistencies right now, it's driving me bonkers. That's my excuse and I'm sticking to it, LOL. We're here! We made it! If I- if I use the notepad by accident, I am gonna rage quit. Why's the editor money? Yeah, yeah. No one will notice the timer's... Like five minutes different. Okay, I'm streaming at like 2 a.m. No one's here in the stream to see it, right? What do we have, like 20 viewers? Thank you, game. Dog. 20 viewers. Good, good, good. Look at all 20 of you popping off. Well, no. What's the next, okay, what's the next RE game's new release? Like, so the release day of an RE game, which one do you guys predict I'll have 20 viewers for? Let's say the franchise continues on till, like, the end of time. Reverse 2. I think the franchise is dead at that point. I wonder if they will make a Revelations 3. Those rumors were wrong about, like, the Rebecca stuff. Apparently. Where's Outbreak? It was on the NVIDIA list for leaked games. Where is it? Mm. 
I seen the Metal Gear Solid remake thing, yeah. In RE0 Remake, the hookshot should be a weapon you use. That's how you get the bat down in the bat fight. You have to constantly go take it out, go into first person mode, shoot him, pull him down. You can get one shot in. He goes back up. Grab the wall. Beep boop beep boop beep 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 boop. Steve time, baby. Best character in the RE universe. You. Ah. Oh god, that was scary. It was like see-through. Mother! RE3 Remake Nemesis Edition or Outbreak? Outbreak. And ne Nemesis Edition would not fix that game. And they could just put Nemesis in Outbreak anyway. He could hunt down Kevin, because Kevin, he's sort of stars, right? I was watching some RE4 remake gameplay last night. Ooh. God, I can't fucking wait. Mm, 2024 CVX 2025 outbreak. I don't know. I mean, they could remake CVX, but remember, guys, I've said this many times. I did a- this is an HD remaster of Outbreak- or of, uh, CVX that I'm currently playing. They ported CVX to the PS4 a couple of years ago, and they ported the non-HD version. If they're not even gonna port their remaster to current gen, what makes you think they're gonna remake the game entirely? You know what I mean? I think there's much more money in an Outbreak remake. Not because Outbreak is a popular fran- a popular, like, game in the franchise, because it's not. But... If RE4- let's say RE4 remake is super good. And people are really feeling RE 
for the RE universe. Releasing a multiplayer game would be the best thing they could do, probably. Multiplayer games typically sell better. Oops! Where am I going? Yeah, I think Capcom is like the top. Hey, squirrel. Excuse me, boys. Who's liking that screen effect in that room? I am. I'm so stupid. What happens if you don't leave in time? I believe you die. Don Carlos. I actually don't know, know Boneyard. I haven't messed around with this game casually too much, honestly. I love this puzzle. Well, like when you actually do it. I hope I did that. I'm always worried I'm gonna do this wrong because I I used to play CVX with notes for all the puzzles, but now I just play by memory and I'm always terrified of doing something wrong. Puzzles. Yo, Jesus imposter. I forget this computer password. Is it 1971? I think. I going? Yeah. Now, 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 now. 
Thank you, Jesus. I'm gonna need a lot of help with Silent Hill 2. Because I don't even run that game. I just play it semi-fast. <laughs> ah! That's scary. The dodge. Sounds like my wife. Um, I tried to run Medieval 1 for a while. All my runs kept dying to the last boss and I gave up. Because I didn't want to practice it. And, well, I did practice it and I got it a couple times in practice and then I could never get it in a run. That, that runs really hard. There's a lot of any percent runs. Would, like sometimes you think of any percent as like the really brain dead category that's like super easy and super glitchy and like anyone can do it like in isolation for example uh but um in medieval and like uh, another good example is breath of the wild like you're just you're going in with so little resources that it's basically a no hit run like in breath of the wild i don't even think you can take damage you just die For Metroid is similar where it's like um you have so little health that any mistake just gets you killed pretty quickly. I think Mega Man X is the same where it's like shit. Okay, this room is can be brutal. Oh, this is bad. That's bad RNG, unfortunately. Gonna get fucked here. Oh, thank you, God. Yep. Yep. So I'm fine. I ran Mega Man X4 actually. Mm. Ran Mega Man X4. I think I ran zero hundred percent. Oh my fucking god! This setup is horrible. That's not RNG, I think I just took a bad line down because I picked up the herb. Yeah, same for the night. I love that game, but that's that's the kind of game where like I would never want to learn the speedrun because it just seems so annoying to run spamming backdash. I don't really enjoy speedruns where you're pressing a button rhythmically for like 40 minutes straight or whatever it is. <laughs> the shaders! They're in trouble. Wait, you don't spam backdash anymore? What's the fastest movement then? Oh, okay. Interesting. So, wait. Oh, he didn't die. 
Bitte. I think it's actually faster to equip the lighting light, lighter here. Ah uh, yes, I'm doing working on a uh a randomizer video of the new BioRand of some of the best things that have happened and a link to the download and all that stuff. Because I don't, I don't even know if I have a uh, a video on my main channel for the new randomizer. I have a fuck ton on my VODs channel, but I don't have any on my main one, I don't think. Should resume main channel uploads pretty soon. I just don't want to upload just like VODs to my main channel anymore. So it's taken me a bit to get some ideas together, but. Ugh. I'll still put all speedruns and challenge runs on my main channel though. Uh, because you're, it's a, it's a terrible idea because, um, for those who don't know on YouTube, if you upload a couple videos that do bad, like in a row, you slowly, slowly get descended into a pit of, uh, a pit of madness. Now to word it just easily, if you put up a few bad videos on YouTube, it kills your channel. They, could, they take you out of the algorithm. The only reason, so like, the, the reason why all of my, um, I think my biggest moment on YouTube was the all the RE4 randos from last year. And the reason they did so well is because the first one did so well that, the, that YouTube pushed the second one, which in turn just pushed all of them in a row. And if you don't do something like that, if, if you lose, or if you stumble during that process, if you know what I mean, then they just they they'll put you in the shadow realm. They really will. All right, here's the glitch, by the way. But yeah, the, the reason why I take I took that route with my main channel now and have the VODs channel and will be doing the clips channel soon is just because like there's been some time some sad times on YouTube. I know this conversation's like like who the fuck cares about this billionaire playboy streamer Bakka Soup and his little shitty world. Uh, but just to be transparent about the whole thing. Um Like, I would have good strings of videos on YouTube, and it would be doing insanely well. Then I'd put up, like, a random horror game I played, like, let's just say, uh, I don't know, can't think of one. Whatever. R insert horror game XY, and it does way worse than my last, like, Resident Evil video or whatever. Then, then now I just spend all month trying to get myself out of the sh shit algorithm YouTube has put me in. And then by the time I get out, I'll put up another, like, video that I played on stream, and then it just dies again, you know? It is how it works, though. Like, really, if you do YouTube stuff, take my advice. Like, if one video works, do a ton revolving around that subject. A great example is, um, I'm sure a lot of you guys watch It's Jabbo. He... Does a lot of Fallout. He's been in my channel a lot. He's 
He's been subbed to the channel for a really long time. I played some games with him on stream too. Um, but his YouTube channel is like on a fucking tear right now. Like every video is getting millions of views. Or I don't know about everyone. I haven't, I haven't checked in a bit. But um, every video is doing really well because he's uploading all Fallout content. Now if he were to, let's say, upload like uh, just a blind playthrough of like Minecraft or whatever. And let's say it did tear, like it did like 5,000 views or less when it normally gets like millions. Then... Uh, if let's say you put up like three or three or four more follow-up videos after that, they wouldn't do well. They would just he would be in the shadow realm for a while, most likely. Most of your views don't come from subs on YouTube. Which is the opposite of Twitch. Most of your views come from followers. That's why it's so weird. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but that's it. That's that's just why I, my main channel has been a little bit finicky lately. Oops. This must be. I gotta do a story play through this sometime this year. Yeah, and that's what makes me, that's what gives me sort of peace that my, my main channel's been sort of in limbo at the moment, but I know that everyone that watches me on here, most people that watch my Twitch, just are satisfied with the VODs channel, which makes me happy. Glad to hear creations. And see, the VODs channel, I don't overly care. I do have it monetized and have ads on videos, but I don't really overly care if a video does really badly because it's it's for it's mainly for you guys. It's mainly just the fan service channel of like anyone that really wants to watch more Bok Soup content. Well, almost every single solitary stream in its entirety is up there. See, the music is bugging out sometimes. I knew it. The emulator's fucked, guys. We gotta get to that airport. Will it come back? Uh oh. Hey, Matt to Rock, how have you been? The no damage legend. What have you been up to lately? Oh my god, it's so buggy. I don't know if this is gonna fix. I might just be hearing the alarm. What did I do to my emulator? Oh my god. Yeah, happy new year. Have you been running anything lately? Yeah, the alarm does go back, back, back. I've never had this happen, where the music just goes away. But yeah, earlier, the game crashed. Oh my god. The game crashed earlier when I first started the, the speedrun. So now I'm really worried. Uh. 
Yeah, just to go further on the YouTube channel. Um, like when RE4 Remake comes out, I'll try and make like a couple videos every week. Like I said before, this this time around for a new RE game, I am going to focus on speedrunning, don't get me wrong. But I'll try and do other like YouTube friendly stuff as well. Um, so I will do a lot more challenges and put them all on YouTube. Oh damn, holy shit. <laughs> Classic. Nice. Of course that would that's what would kill the run. That's crazy, dude. You are nuts. Yeah, read what Matt Rock says, guys. He does insane no damage single segment runs. All one go. Like It's nuts. Well, I still do randos. When? Sorry. Mm -hmm. So people ask me a lot to do, um, Five, like, oh, you should do CVX knife only for this marathon. So all the other games for the most part, are pretty good with knife only, but CVX is actually really hard. You might think to yourself, like, what? The knife is OP in Code Veronica. True. But let me give you one example. This boss fight with knife only? What? <gasps> Wait, what, what's happening? Am I crazy? I thought that was almost eight. Oh wait, am I? I'm so bad. I'm so fucking bad, dude. I don't know if that was an inconsistency or if I'm just not even using my brain. I'm scared. Anyway, uh, a lot of boss fights in this are very, very particular. Um, the music's back, yeah. If you... If you do one wrong move on that boss fight, like the one we just did, you're dead. He just pushes you into the fire, you get game over. Uh, and Alexia is a one hit kill. Nosferatu could throw you off the side. And final Alexia, you need like five full heals for. So it's like, knife only in this game is rough. I do have two finished runs of knife only, no save, no, no death um, on my YouTube, but. Yeah, it's not something that's marathon safe, really. Yeah, thank you, Matt. You too, sir. Oh, God. It's basically a DPS race. Woohoo! Steve for RE2 Randomizer. I forget how many shots this is. I think it's 26. I'll do 28, just in case. No, Code Veronica um, doesn't have a randomizer or like anything special. No mods. It just says door skip on emulator. That's about it. It doesn't have a PC version, so. There's, there's no music that plays here. Starts when you turn the power on. Or right here, I think. Yeah, thank you. Uh, thank you, Gemma. Mm. 
Uh... Oops. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm very good at this game now. Don't, don't, don't. Thank you. This game needs a door randomizer. terrible at this game. I was being sarcastic. Now I'm okay. It's just this has been a bad run. I'm so distracted from the emulator. That's my excuse of sticking to it. No, randomizers won't soft lock you if they're done correctly. Like, it's very, very rare you'll get soft locked in a rando. Unless it's like a brand new patch or something. But they're coded in a way that, that, like, that won't happen. Fuck you! Can't believe I'm in caution. Oh, we have a first aid spray. Yeah, like, you can't softlock in the RE1 Remake Rando, for example. And if you did softlock, that's like one in frickin' 10,000 chance. But, like, it's- it- for some randomizers, you almost have the same chance as, like, glitching out and softlocking the base game. For example, like, playing Tomb Raider 1 for the first time and jumping through a wall by accident without saving it, you know, you're so you're, you're, you have to restart. So similar to, like, the odds of in some randomizers, like, you not getting the item you need. I don't think we need to deposit the knife for Chris. I can't remember. I think he's got his own. This is gonna be a PB. Well, that's impossible, but thank you. My PB was actually pretty decent in Code Veronica. Clear. I was in third or fourth for a really long time. Thank you, Gundam Girl. I can't PB in any, any RE in a marathon. There's absolutely no way. As I took, for the runs I have on my, on the leaderboard, the runs I submitted or, um, I spent a lot of time grinding. So like just randomly getting one is not going to happen. Beep, boop, beep, boop. Oh, you piece of shit. This room is horrid. Mm. 
Eep boop. Beep boop, beep boop, beep boop, beep boop. Gundams. Your guys' favorite okay. Gundam. I'm bad. Okay, good. I almost got poisoned. Chris starts facing a wall. Says so much about the character. Bow gun seems broken. It's actually slower than using the knife. The knife is the strongest weapon for that fight. No! Fuck, I hate when he does this. Blah. By the way, you guys know in RE3, the worm fight? This is just as bad, by the way. He needs to, he needs to come up and just stay up, or he can't die. Oh my god, it's so bad! Why does this fight exist? Yeah, we're, we're like fucked. Uh, no, I can't. I'm not going to risk losing the run on this. I'm just leaving. Of course he does it now. Oh, really, Matt? When I ran the game, there wasn't a way. And it was just like, you pray he fucking stays up. Well, this makes the run way shittier having no explosive rounds. Thank you. I've never done a real run of this game on door skip though. Hey, Liz. Oh, cool. Okay. Try that next time. Yeah, I've always just walked three steps up and right and then started running. It seemed semi-consistent, but yeah, obviously. <laughs> obviously not. 100%. Yeah, I'm trying to reset my schedule, guys. That's why I'm live so late. I know this is a horrible stream time. Yo, Kid Dynamite. I hope you've been well as well. What have you been up to lately? Nice to see you. Mr. Dynamite. Oh man, Twitch is crazy. Seeing all, like, there's a bunch of people I haven't seen in a while here just because I, my schedule is completely fucked right now. Um. Oh, I see. Look at what I was just saying. Uh. Hmm. Yo, Olive. This, this run's taking over my brain, dude. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, 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 I no one's actually asked me very much today, but, uh, yeah, I watched Last of Us yesterday. It was actually fucking sick, I thought. They nailed it. Um, we talked about it earlier, but, uh, like, watching Last of Us just made me think, like, all those people that say... Oh, an RE show can't be done. Or movie. It's like, yes it can. Just stay fucking close to the source material. Last of Us is a bit of a... 
It's not too fair being like, oh, Last of Us can do it, any game can. Because Last of Us is a very cinematic game already. Like, all you really need to do is bring in actors and make them just reread the script of the actual game. And you got yourself a decent, like, cinematic experience, whether it's movie or TV show. But at the same time, like, we talk, like, RE2 Remake is shot in a cinematic way as well. The intro, the first segment in the gas station, yada, yada, yada. So... Um, it can also be done. Oops. It's just the people who make the RE shit don't know what the fuck they're doing. And then you have Last of Us was really good. God, I'm s my brain is like so numb for this. Yeah, yeah, they're not doing one-to-one, -one, but they're staying close enough to the source material that, um... I, I thought it was awesome. I actually thought the first episode was really fucking good. If you guys are on the fence about Last of Us, um... I, I thought it was sick. Like, it has such a good intro, too, as a... <gasps> what? I thought you came here first. I'm so bad. I'm so bad. It's, ins it's insane. It's insane how bad I am at this game today. Holy fucking shit, dude. Oh my god. My last run! Last time I ran this in a marathon, the run went so well. This run's just- oh, oh, it's so bad. It's so bad. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Ah, oh, Makes me sick. Yeah, it was like two or three weeks ago. Yeah, Twitch is fine. Or it worked at Discord. Yeah, that's cool. Chucky renewed to season three. Thank you, Otto. Thank you, Big Bacon. No, I haven't seen Megan yet. I really want to, but um the theater that you guys remember the hurricane that uh Killed my power for a week back in September. Um, yeah, it, it destroyed the movie theater, so I don't have a movie theater. There, There is one on the island, but it's like an hour long drive there and back. Like, each way is an hour. So, it's not too fun. And I don't drive, so... Megan has insane reviews, by the way. Uh, it's like one of the highest reviewed horror movies ever. <laughs> it's actually like shocking. Yeah. Gabriel. I assume it's just similar to Child's Play where it's more comedy horror. Nothing wrong with that though. Cream is the same way and 
I mean, honestly, thinking now that I'm putting some thought into this, you know, Nightmare on Elm Street was also the same way. But I, but Megan probably has more emphasis on comedy, it seems. Similar to Child's Play. Yeah, Evil Dead Rises looks awesome, I think. Yeah, the Child's Play remake was just okay. Pretty forgettable, in my opinion. Oh yeah, I sort of for yeah, I I actually forget a lot of Chucky. Yeah, I forgot it was like uh, Stranger Things and it. That's true, it was. Beep boop. Blow this joint. The gamer senses, they're all gone. I'm taking this, just in case. <laughs> oh god, the shit run gets shittier. It's okay. Yay, no poison. Hey Nemi, thank you. Glad you can catch the stream live. Yeah, Poison Hunters is a pretty bad decision. Felt like they were just out of ideas. Like introducing Hunter Gamma and the new attacks Hunter Gamma has, I think that was a great way to mix it up. Um, but Poison Hunter is just like lazy. Slightly different color palette, and now the tankiest, most damaging, uh, bio, or like, common bio weapon in the franchise poisons you. It's like, okay. Thick, dog. Thank you, thank you. I will check it out. Oh! What? My brain is such a jumble for this. Any hobbies besides cooking? Exercise. Yeah. Wow Arena, yeah. I've still been playing Dragonflight. It's it's still fun. I need to grab those grenade rounds. Oh, I guess I don't need to because I grabbed the ones earlier. This is the longest I've played a new expansion in forever. But I can't stop until I get Gladiator. Ooh. 
Oh my god, dude, please. Um, no, I don't have an arena team. I'm just doing solo shuffle at the moment. The highest I've been is 2270. But solo shuffle's rough because the queue times are so long. Yeah, I like that a lot. All the mini bosses in this game you can just run away from. But no, I didn't finish the, the raid yet. I did most of it on heroic. But not the last, the two last bosses. I didn't even fin I actually haven't even done much of it on normal. I just did heroic and then. Yeah. Just with a pug as well. Beep, beep, boop, boop, beep, beep, boop, boop. Uh, I've been playing Shadow Priest. Well, I've been playing Enhancement and Shadow Priest, but um, Enhancement's like horrific for PvP, so I sort of stopped playing it. And Shadow's like absolutely busted for PvP. It's been like the best spec for PvP this expansion. I mean, it just got super nerfed, but it's still like, it's still decent. Um, but it definitely is a lot weaker now, but that's fine. There's a downside to your favorite thing in a competitive game getting nerfed, and that's that, or it being bad, because if you run into it, no one knows how to play against it. But if you run into someone playing something that everyone plays, everyone knows the counter, you know? Just like League, like, some bad champions in League are really fucking good, because they're so uncommon to see, that when you do see them, you know they're bad, but you get wrecked by them because you don't know what they do. Yeah, enhancements like brain dead right now and bad. The new raid's cool though. I, I really like like Dragonflight as an expansion's the best expansion since Legion. Maybe even better than Legion. Oh my god, that was so fucking stupid. Is there- hey, if you're still here, Matt, is there a way to avoid that? Is that RNG? Curious what you do for that room in, uh, no damage. Please don't fucking kill me! Please don't do it! Oh, thank god. The professions, I think, were... Yeah, they could have been done better. I- I like... Where they're going with the new professions. I, I think Dragonflight is is a step in so I don't think it's enough to get most people to come back and play WoW. It probably sold not too well. But it is definitely an expansion in the right direction. I think the next expansion or the one after will be like people will absolutely love it. But I'm sure I think they've learned a lot from this one. Oh, uh, okay. Let's see. I know, I wish they'd make a new MMO as well. Especially, so, like, I get most of my enjoyment with WoW playing PvP, and the only people that, like, 95% of the people that play PvP these days are people that just do it every expansion, and they're just extremely no life and, like, a lot of big streamers. So, like, your odds of getting, like, rank 1 in PvP or something you know, you're competing against people that stream it 
like distortion twos, but wow, that all they do every day, all day, 12 hours a day is play and study and live wow. And then they stop streaming wow and they watch other people play wow. Like you're not gonna beat those players. Doesn't matter how gifted you are. Then their knowledge of the game is just far too superior. It's always nice having a new, uh, a new game where everyone's on the same playing field. I need to add disting. Yeah, you can play solo now, um, but it's sort of bad. It's, it's okay, but... Uh, the new- the Amazon MMO is called... Oh, what's that one? Uh... Oh... No, it's not out yet. Is it- wait, is, is New World the Amazon one? I thought it was... Oh, Ashes of Creation. I thought that was- I thought that was the one. I don't know. Ashes of Creation looks okay. MMOs are a very close to dead genre. Like, MMOs have always been a slightly dead genre. Just... Wow, World of Warcraft was way too good when it came out. So every other MMO just failed to... Failed in comparison, and then Final Fantasy XIV. Now when you release an MMO, you have to compete with Final Fantasy XIV, WoW, and like Lost Ark, and... But Lost Ark isn't new. Lost Ark is ancient, I'm pretty sure. It's just new in North America. <clears throat> and it's not... Lost Ark isn't even doing that amazing anymore. As far as I know, a lot of the players are bots, but... I'm not saying it's a bad game. I played a lot of Lost Ark when it came out, but, um... You know, I'm just saying... But no genre is as dead as RTS, though. They're just MMOs are sort of evolving. Like, as as a MMO player, I religiously played MMOs when I was a kid. I started with the fans. I started with the Fantasy Star Online Episode 1 for the GameCube, then I started playing Final Fantasy XI for the PS2, then I played Outbreak, then I played, uh, I think there was one more on console, um, I can't remember. I played a lot of Dungeon Siege and stuff, but that's not an MMO. Um, then I got into Star Wars Galaxies, then I bought Fa Final Fantasy XI on PC, then I bought City of Heroes and City of Villains, um, and yeah, when WoW came out, it just sort of killed everything else. Like, you know, everyone stopped playing every other game and they just played WoW. That was close. That wasn't. Yeah, Rune oh yeah, I started with RuneScape. I forgot that one. Um, but yeah, nowadays- okay, I didn't even finish my thought. So, yeah, then WoW killed everything, but now, with, like, League of Legends, that took a lot of MMO players. Like, I- I stopped playing MMOs entirely when League came out, and I just played League. I- that's all I played. I played League and, like, Counter-Strike and a couple other things, but to fill that MMO void, I would use League of Legends. And I feel like now- nowadays, that- the, like, MMO, people that like playing MMOs or enjoy them play other things that are, like, a lot easier to queue up for and get into, like, Overwatch or Valorant or League of Legends or Fortnite. Like, once BR games came out, it's just sort of... It's, it's, a, it's a really heavy topic to talk about. I don't think anyone really cares, but... MMOs are... It's just a rough genre now. See, League and Valorant and Overwatch and stuff like that. Those are very easy to just pick up and instantly start playing and getting to the good stuff. Where, like, right now for a 
for a WoW player like myself. Like, what do I enjoy in World of Warcraft? Playing with my friends? Okay, that's every game. But I enjoy doing Arena. If I'm playing by myself, I enjoy doing Arena. And Arena queues are 30 minutes each. Sometimes even longer. Worst part about running CVX is the best parts of the game don't exist in the speedrun. The music. That song plays for like two seconds. It's one of the best songs of the franchise. But yeah, the MMO genre is in dire straits and... Like, WoW's still doing well and Final Fantasy XIV's still doing well and stuff, but... For someone to make a new one, I think they're crazy. Nah, WoW 2 is never going to happen. Like, because cause people value their progress in the original WoW, so... But like, yeah, it, it's all, like, they're all Caradoc stick gameplay, theme park geared. That's my... F like, when... Like, when a new expansion isn't out and not a ton of people are playing, WoW or an MMO. I like doing that stuff. I like going to farm like transmog and different mounts and mini pets and stuff. I really really enjoy that. Like I enjoy the dress up part of uh, those games a lot. Um, but yeah, it's just it's just tough. And those games have a here's a massive problem within MMOs at least WoW. There's not enough healers. People that play healer or tank to make it so you can do anything anytime. You're always waiting on someone. And that's same with like League and, and Valorant and, and Dota or, or, or I don't know about Valorant, I've never played actually. But same with League, like if you want to play certain roles, sometimes you have to wait longer. It depends how, how diehard you are with the game. Even back during WoW and League's Prime, um, I my, put my whole fucking life into it, like, didn't shower for weeks and shit, just played all day every day. So, I was really high rated in these games, and sometimes when you get super high rated, your queue times get brutal too. So, it just, it, you reach that, uh, you just go full circle, like, when I was super high rated in Arena in early WoW, like Burning Crusade and Wrath of the Lich King, sometimes I'd have to wait, like, one to two hours to play a single game that lasts one minute. You'd have to sit there and do nothing for two hours. And then you get to play for two minutes, you know? Um, in League, I got to my Diamond 1 promos. Back before Master was a thing. It just went Diamond 1 to Challenger. And I failed my Diamond 1 promos because of a stupid fucking AFK Annie. Not that I would have won that game anyway, but still. After that though, that was sort of my tilting point for League. When I lost those the Diamond 1 promos and shit, that was around the same time that I got into speedrunning, and then I'm just like, fuck this. But I first became a streamer because I wanted to be a pro League player, basically. I mean, I played so much of it and I was so high rated that I'm like, well, why don't I just stream it? Fuck off. Do I have a lot of ammo? Whatever. Lulz. Yeah, I always want to see the future of these games, like the future of League and WoW and like, will they be around? Will the company that made them just outdo themselves and that will be what replaces it? Some games do kill themselves and get replaced by others. I'm trying to think. Um, but you could compare- it's the same kind of thing with like websites, you know. Back in the day, people used to use like AOL Messenger and then MSN and that now- then Facebook came along, dominated the industry, you know. Thank you for the five gifted subs, super nerd. Thank you. Oh my god, does anyone remember the password? I can't remember. Anyone? 
Anybody? I did that a long time ago, like five years ago, and someone in my YouTube comments was pissed at me. Or they thought I was being serious. This, this is definitely... Uh, Dead five. Space, 100%. Yeah, Super Nerd. That is definitely a point in this game where, like, totally when people were kids, they would get to this thing and be like, What is the password? <laughs> then they'd sit there for like an hour and be like, Oh! Oh! It may be actually available. It might be in that notebook you open. I don't even remember. Fuck you! Nice! That's so good. Do I have a heal? It could get remade one day, I don't know. Fight's so dumb. It is a speedrun killer. Many world records die here because she has to fly into it. You can't just aim at her and shoot. I mean, you might be able to. I don't think you can, though. You sort of just have to get lucky. Like, there's a lot of times where you just aim and shoot and she's dead. And then sometimes that happens. Move. I'll be right back. No. I'm going to use the potty. I'm going to come back. And Silent Hill time. Be right back. Chris! Well done, Chris. It turns out that Alexia's work wasn't much of anything. So now, the only thing left is revenge. Let her go, Wesker! You don't want her. Fine. Claire! Today's a good day. I came for Alexia, but killing you is even better. Sorry to disappoint you, but Alexia is gone. That's no longer a concern to me. I have Steve to work with. What? Steve. In his body, there's still a living T. Alexia virus. Steve should be a good specimen. Maybe he'll come back alone, just as I did, and be able to see your sister again. You freak! Don't you touch him! I'm sorry, dear heart. But my men have already taken him. You get out of here, Claire. But what about... As a surviving member of Stars, I have to... Remember your promise. I'll end this once and for all. Say hello to my comrades who have killed. I don't know where you get your confidence, Chris. Self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. The self-destruct system 
has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. Oh, shit. Sure. Wesker. No! Thank you, Sayak. Today's your lucky day. Next time we meet, don't count on another. Next time. Until we Until meet again. We meet again. <laughs> <laughs> Someone asking if I had any other hobbies sparked like a 15 minute conversation about gaming. Thank you, Tomley. Chris, where are you? I guess I'll watch the whole thing now that we're this far. that I always keep my promises. <laughs> it's part of like two FPS even on console. Or it just looks weird. You me it's slow motion. Chris, promise me. Please promise that you won't leave me alone again. I'm sorry, Claire, but it's not over yet. There's still something we've got to do. Take a chat. You mean Yeah! It's payback time. We've got to destroy Umbrella. Now Let's finish this once and for all! Boom! I like the ending of Code Veronica. See, one of the best thing about Code Veronica, well, the soundtrack, and I think the story, it's, it's fun to play a, a Resident Evil game that actually has a story. It's not just, well, it's funny saying that, like, oh, let's finish Umbrella. But we're not getting an S this time, fellas. Woo! Do 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 do. All right, people. Why is my layout so far? Um, you guys get to see more door. Uh. Wait, my layout is truly fucked up. Whoop. 
Good enough. Um, oh, I'm going to need help with one Silent Hill 1 puzzle. Ouch. Yes. What's the worst Resident Evil game in your opinion? Umbrella Corp. What? Ouch. Do you think Kendo would have beaten Wesker? Yeah. Thank you, Super Nerd. And thank you for dancing. Should we do UFO ending or normal? Wait. I will need help though. There's one. Nah, no need for a poll. It was obvious what was gonna win that. Oh shit, I forgot to delete my splits. Bow, na, now, 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 now. Oh shit, did I change my game? Thank you, caffeine. I'm hyped for Saddle 2 Remake. Me, 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 me. Footsteps. Just run over here. Look at that ass. Dude, if Silent Hill 1 gets remake, he needs an Cheryl? ass upgrade. Is that Cheryl? Bad. Is that Cheryl? Where are you going? Yeah, he needs to be double. Hey, wait, stop. Double cheeked up. Look at that thing. Shits out of that thing. Oh, I'm hyped because I don't care if it's a bad game. Uh, well, I mean, I hope it's a great game, but if it's bad, at least we could laugh at it. For Saddle 2, it's hard to tell if it's going to be good or not. Thank you, Giga. Bow now. Yeah, you should hear the clapping. The clapping should be louder than the footsteps. I agree. met someone that their ass cheeks clapped as they walked but they're definitely this? out there anyone in chat what's going on here yes it would definitely depend on the kind of pants you wear and they probably wouldn't subject themselves to that kind of pants maybe thank you mr chicken doodle how was your stream Bluebird also has to make a game that has gameplay for the first time What's ever. What's that? Huh. Radio. What's going on with that radio? And that's a bit worrying.
What? No. What? Dude! This is not a dream. What's happening to this place? Swag step. Yeah, I used to have record in this game actually. Multiple times in different categories too. But yeah, I had the any percent record for this game for a while. I think I got it back when I lost it once. Oh, oh, actually, so I had record, lost it, got it back, lost it, and then me and the previous record holder, he probably has record right now, um, we actually tied record, and then I haven't played it since then. Or haven't ran it since then. But we tied record, and you know what's the crazy thing? I'm not even lying. We tied record on the same day and almost the same time because they we were both streaming the game at the same time and yeah we got a tie um and we just agreed to not run it anymore <laughs> and then punchy came and beat both of our times and then he duked it out with punchy for a while and i haven't played since really Yeah, of course Punchy beats the tie. I did run the game again um, a few years back when the new Out of Bounds glitch was found. But it's just, it just didn't do well on stream anymore. I, there was another reason I stopped playing. Remember, there was a, a specific reason I stopped running the game. I can't remember a hundred percent. Wow, this is bullshit! Oh my god! Please, please, please stop! Any games I had record for, I'd try to reacquire. Nah. I don't like being a one game streamer anymore. Unless it's a new game. I just don't enjoy running older games anymore. Like, I. I my channel has only, you know, every year my channel gets more and more popular and every year, like for people that have been here for like six years or seven or even eight, I've been streaming for like almost nine, I think. I, all I did for the first, or not the, the first year, I, all I did is play League of Legends, but, um, you know, I spent like three years straight just, or maybe it was... I slowed down on speedrunning, I think, in 2019. So from 2014 to 2019, basically all I did is speedrun. And, um, yeah, you know, I've had world, many world records and top times and stuff. And, um, you know, this is specifically for older games. And that's all fun. But I've played the older games that I enjoy to death. There's none left that I, like, want to grind. Thank you, Misaki. And the stream just doesn't do as well with speedruns anymore. It really doesn't. Like, it, trust me. It's also very, very hard to make YouTube content as a speedrunner. I mean, well, if you're actually a, like a dead serious speedrunner, the only content you're going to be making is your PBs. And no one wants to see those. They want to see record. <clears throat> no, no, I'm, I'm not tired. Like... 
I'm not doing anything competitively at right now on stream, but uh, I um I was gonna say village came out last year. No, village came out two years ago. No, I still want to grind for records and stuff. Just not in old games. It's just really hard to grow your channel. It's boring for me, and my channel does worse. So it's just three bad things, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, when Village came out, I was in second the entire time I ran the game. Blah, blah. Do, do. Oops. Uh, if it was Claire B for the American GameCube. Ugh. Uh, no, Sonata One's a pretty easy speed run. There's some things that make it a little challenging. Um, like door bumps are really hard to avoid. Yeah, if you're well, I mean, he does almost exactly what I do. He picks smart game or tries to pick smart games to run, which is what I do. But using Dist as an example, like if he went back and ran Dark Souls One, for example, he would be miserable, and the channel wouldn't do it nearly as well. You know, it's just how Twitch is. When you get to a certain size, you... Uh, 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 no, wait, it's... Oh, God, guys. I... Okay. Oh, no, I have to restart this. I need help with the puzzles. I need help! Uh, this one? This is it. It's gotta be. Okay, thank God. That wasn't it. I would have fucked. Hey, Griff, welcome. Yeah, I, I sort of hate this conversation because I feel like people get me the wrong way. Like, every time I talk about this, there's always people lurking or in the comments. Not particularly right now, they're like, oh, yeah. It's fine if you don't like speedrunning anymore. I love speedrunning. It's just... Like, some people are like, oh, when are you gonna run RE1? Again. Jill any percent. Like, I've ra Dude, I'm so fucking tired of that. <laughs> like, you know... I, I... We had this discussion... Uh... A few days ago, but... Um... It has nothing to do with haters. See, the... Oh my god. So, for uh, Resident Evil 2 is the absolute best example of this. Resident Evil 2 speedruns, I just hate saying this because there are people that still run the game and stuff, and that's all good for them. But, like, if I ran Leon A any percent, trust me, it's far worse content than just, like, grinding out hard randomizers or uh, challenge runs or whatever else. Because that category, for me and in general, has been done to fucking death. So, like... Yeah. Yeah, someone tied his record, but that's it. Oh yeah, that's what I do. I, I stream what I enjoy. This this conversation sort of revolves around people asked someone asked, would I ever go back and grind out a record I've lost? Like, no. I get no enjoyment at a grinding world records I've already had. Or ones that are, like, a lifetime away.
Excuse me, sir. Yeah, I love marathon day. I love I there's this is my favorite day of the week when I do marathons because I love running these games. It's just there's a difference between running like Silent Hill 1, which is really fun for me, and resetting because you bumped into a door and starting from the first and doing that for every single day, all day, eight hours a day, seven days a week for like five months straight. There's a big difference between playing the game fast one time and playing it, maybe beating it once in two months because all you do is reset. There's a massive difference. Oh. Rewind time, it's rewind time. Uh... I mean, I don't, know, I don't find Dino Crisis too scary. I found it scary when I was a kid, though. Yeah, guys, it all depends. Twitch, Twitch and, like, content creation is a very complicated thing. and It's been a huge part of my life now for, like, nine years, and I have taken it dead serious and just lived it day in, day out, and just... Some things, like, like I said, RE2 Original is the best example. It's just like, some things just aren't smart for me to play anymore, nor do I want to play them. So the combination of those two things makes me never play them. Man. This always reminds me of uh, Dead by Daylight Midwitch. I can't believe they included this little easter egg in that level. Makes me very happy. Uh, I don't know. Seba? <clears throat> Help me God! With all this being said, I'll probably run Dead Space Remake and definitely run RE4. But yeah, just to sum it up so everyone understands, I only like doing something competitively if I put my entire life into it. And um, when there's other stuff people want to see, it's not fun putting your entire life into an old game everyone's seen a million times. Oops. I played Cannibal Abduction a few days ago. I know, I hope it has cutscenes. Dude, Dead Space Remake better be a good speed game. I, I'm so sick of getting excited for new speed games and they suck, like Kalisto, with the unskippable cutscenes. It's like, dude. We'll see. Ex Exactly, I hate this conversation. That's not what I'm saying at all. I love competitive content. Like, that's, I like doing competitive stuff more than non-competitive stuff. But people just always read the conversation the wrong way. It's all good, though. It's, it's fine that not everyone understands. I don't expect everyone to. Yeah, I can't wait for Dead Island 2. It's gonna be fun. I hope it's gonna be fun. Kalisto, I, I mean, Kalisto did get overhyped for sure. You could tell what the game was gonna be like with the trailers that were released, but I think people were expecting something that wasn't in the trailers when that didn't exist. Yeah, Mansion of Evil, I think it's called. Uh, AZ. It's- it's awesome. Maybe I lost bullet. Downpour protocol. Well, no, they didn't. But I mean, you should have cutscene skip. Like, Every game should be able to skip cutscenes.
No cutscene skip is such a fucking awful choice. What is this? Is it? Guys, I don't remember what this is. I really need help. Oh god, it's either right to here, and what? I'm gonna have to try a few things here. Left twice, right valve, left twice. Oh, thank you. Okay. Woo, thank you. You're a, you're a savior. Thank you, God. We keep getting to this part, and I just sit here and try and do the puzzle. Because I can't remember the speed run. <laughs> oh, it's terrible. All right. But yeah, guys, I, I can't stress enough. I can't fucking wait to grind the living fuck out of RE4 Remake and try and get record for the hardest category. Which I hope there's like a, you die once, you die forever. Same with Dead Space. If I run Dead Space, I'm going to run the super hard category where one death is GG. Um, and I'm very excited to do that. It's just specifically the older games that I've played a million times. I just don't want to run because I find it very boring. <laughs> I think they said they're going to have a uh, one death and it's over. Um, they said they're adding harder difficulties than that were in the original. Yeah, like Inferno, Inferno RE3 remake was so fun. Oh my god. I'm super, super pumped. Well, yeah, but those those like deathless games, like those are really hard if you're if like your first second playthrough or whatever. But if you have like hundreds of hours in the game, that shit's easy. Well, maybe it won't be. That'd be cool. But honestly, though, Village of Shadow, it's it's funny with Village of Shadows. That speedrun category is one of the hardest in the franchise, if not the hardest. It was really, really tough. Honestly, probably a little too tough. It was- it wasn't fun resetting on the first like and in the game. Because <laughs> everyone reset there so often, it was pretty brutal. I just hope RE4 has a fast intro you can get past quickly. Just like RE4 Original. Like, you're straight to the action in RE4 Original. Right away. And, um... That's what makes it a fun speed game. Same with RE3. RE3 Original, straight to the action. RE2 Original, you have to reset on the basketball court. RE2... Or RE1, you have to watch the two intro cutscenes. And then, if you're really trying to be optimal, King Henry is the reset point, And then it's back to the start. I hate games with awful reset points. RE7 is like fucking horrid for that. Thank you, Abra, for the five gifted subs. Thank you. Thank you. Well, for sure, Gary. Yeah, I don't doubt that. But holding in the run button and going from point A to point B usually speeds things up a lot. Yo, Clownface, thank you for the four months. Thank you. Thank you, Abra. I appreciate the generosity. Do, 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 do. But it's obvious RE4 is going to have the same like story beats. I'm sure you'll be in the main village within 10 minutes of the speedrun or 5 minutes of the speedrun. We'll see though. 
I did, by the way, I called in village, or Resident village, watch the past broadcast, buddies. I called that you'd be at your house as Ethan doing, well, I said you'd be doing the dishes and like changing a Rose's diaper and shit, but it wasn't too far from that. That game was set up to have a terrible intro. But I think RE4 should be fast. It all depends. Um, cause there's a big chance RE4 might start as Ashley. I think it, it's a big possibility that you'll play as Ashley first, then get captured, then play as Leon. Maybe not though. I don't think so, Punish Snake. I, I think it'll just play a lot more like RE2 Remake. RE7 and RE Village play very similar. They, they, they have the long, drawn-out intro. This follow very similar um, beats. Hey, Demo, thank you. Hopefully. Yo, Rossi? Oh god, no. I hate RE3 makes an intro. It's terrible. Especially for the speed run. You just have no freedom at all. It feels like you're getting sucked through a vacuum. One of my favorite things about RE3 original is that you, like, you can, minus the first, like, 10 seconds, you can go back to the start of the game, and things actually change when you go back there, and RE3 Remake is just, you can never go back, like, anywhere. You're constantly locked out of previous areas. Have reverse support. Now that's a good question. I think the only new RE that has a fun intro in speedruns is 2 Remake. You're just straight to the action relatively fast in 2 Remake. But yeah, I, I overall I hope RE4 is similar to RE2 because RE2 is a god tier speed game. That's a good question. Yeah, I hope they remove checkpoints. They were way too excessive of checkpoints in 4. In my opinion. Uh, uh, I'm stupid. It's this way. I just hope they rebalance 4. Normal, sure, give checkpoints, but professional, limited saves, no checkpoints, no bullshit rocket launcher that you can buy to eliminate every problem in front of you and get paid for it.
But four is relatively a balanced experience. It's just, uh, guys, I am drawing so many blanks. Okay, I now know what I'm doing. Too heated of a conversation. Yeah, I hope they don't tone down the violence as well. Oh, uh, not there's nothing I hope to see. There's a lot of great moments in the game. I honestly just hope it's a good speed game. That's it. No bullshit in intro. I always forget if this is up and left or down and... I think this is the right way. Oh my god, I just, sorry, I keep just staring at chat and oh. I don't have the muscle memory for this shit. Oh. Move, asshole. Stupid having to use my brain. I hope they have awesome costumes in RE4 as well. I want Ashley in a Chun-Li outfit. And... Ada to have a Regina costume. Yada yada yada. Or... I miss when Capcom used to do cross-promotion all the time. Yeah, I... There might... I assume they'll have unlockable costumes too. It, it depends. I hope there's a lot of unlocks. I also just hope it has a lot of replayability, like RE2 Remake. RE7, Village, and 3 Remake had garbage replayability, and 2 Remake had, like, absolute top tier. I'm, I'm gonna go out on a limb and assume most people that played all four of those games have more playtime in RE2 Remake than the other three combined. What's this? Probably not everybody, obviously, but... For those who do replay their games. As I do. And I speed around all four of them. Yeah, citizen. I feel like that's a lot of people. Cool, Goku. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure there are many people like you. Yeah, the, the gameplay in 3 Remake was amazing. Excuse me, sir. It was really, really... It's a really, really fun game. Was I dreaming? Hmm. Here's the setter for the glitch. Bow now. Thank you again, Maggot and Dima. 
do. Oh, nice, easy. Yeah, one, like, I really enjoyed Village as a speed game once you're past the intro. Probably why I've played RE3 original so much is there is no, like, the intro is like um, 60 seconds. Yeah, the basement is a huge meme, but at least you get to play the game, like, instead of holding W. Re remake seven and eight. The speedruns are all holding W for like five to ten minutes. Well, seven is like eighteen minutes or something. But it is normal for horror games to have slow intro because you have to build up the tension. <gasps> Yo, hipster. All right, guys, I need to make a save state here. Where am I? Wait, not here. Nice, Christus. No, don't be sad. Save state. Boom. All right, come on. We can do this. We can do this. One try, right? How long do you think it'll take, guys? First try? No. Nice, Bran. It's hard to play them in order, because <laughs> some of them take place, like, in between each other. No! Okay, good. It didn't fuck me up. Come on! Sir? Where'd he go? Oh my god, please. He might have bugged me out. We're about to find it. Oh, he did. Thanks, dude. Let me in, let me in. Let me in, let me in. That'd be a pretty fast cooking stream. Come on! Come here! You bastard. Okay, good. We're still in. You guys will see what's supposed to happen very soon here. Alright, you know, I'm not gonna move forward this time. I'm just gonna let him have his way with me. Shit. Okay, we're good. Come on, monkey man! Why am I, like, floating? I think it's bugged. Please! <laughs> Sir! Come back! 
Sir! It is the gnarliest part. It's, oh yeah, I am bugged. It's not, it's actually not too bad if you practice it. It's just terrible without practice. I've had a lot of marathon runs where you get this first try and other times where it takes like 20 minutes. Oh my god. Please just fucking work. YOLO. Ooh, bastard. Can you do that again? Shit. We got this. Alright, come on. Come on! No, 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 don't do that! Come here, you asshole! Oh my god, jump, you... Come back! Come back! Dude! So stupid. Come on. I wonder, if, is there anything else like this in Silent Hill Runs? Like, did the strats, strats change at all? Yeah, it's very... Well, this is the problem with glitches. Like... Glitchless speed runs? Easy. Easy every time. Glitch speed runs? Enjoy doing a frame perfect glitch. That, with no practice. Blah. Yeah, Silent Hill 3 speedrun has changed so much. I sort of want to run that game again, just to see. It's actually, like, even far different from when I ran it last time and did the alt-enter glitch. It's crazy now. Eh, this probably won't work. Thank you, Larry, for the 72 and the tier 2. Thank you. Crazy. Sir! Am I dead? No. We're fine. Yeah, there's a bunch of new stuff in Silent Hill 3. Apparently, you're supposed to... Come on, dude. <sighs> Brutal. Apparently, you're supposed to spam the supply button in Silent Hill 3 now. Like, the whole run, I think. That's what I heard. Alright, whatever. I'm just gonna do this. We got it. I have no clue, Snake. here thank you spunky thank you
Yeah. Oh god, I sort of forget how to get out of here. I think it's this way. It's not. I don't know what I'm doing. It's this way. It's not. It's this way. This is, by the way, when we run Silent Hill 2 later, this is me the entire game. Thank you, Mass Tag. Thank you. Yeah, I think Twin Snakes, Twin Snakes is just such a lazy ass game. Freeze, who are you? Yo, Sorry, thank you, Evil Cherry Berry. Thank you for the raid. How was your stream? Welcome, everybody. Boom. Welcome, welcome, welcome. That's true, chillin'. Sir! I need to heal, I think. Hey, Mutt, Nick. Nice, it is. Thank you. A dual sense PS5 controller? I don't know if I'm going to buy that. Not sure. Maybe. I use my PS5 as a decorative item for my background. Look. See it? Thank you, Vault. Excuse me, sir. This is going to hit me again. Oh, whew. N64 is peak controller. That hurts to read. That controller is so uncomfortable. It's just the GameCube controller, except the thumbstick is hard plastic, and if you want to use a third of the controller, you have to take your hand off the controller and re-put it back on. Genius. Yeah, I've played the Splinter Cell games. <laughs>
I don't even want a remake of Metal Gear Solid 1. We already got Twin Snakes and then you revisit the place in 4. And like, if they did remake Metal Gear Solid 1, I would like it to be a lot different. Cause like, Metal- Twin Snakes was like way too similar. Like all the voice- all the lines are the exact same. And it still sucked. I think I would enjoy Twin Snakes a, a bit more if they it just had a good soundtrack. I can't see. Yeah, I, I watched a speedrun of Splinter Cell a few years back, and uh, it looked rough. But I played those games like right when they came out. Did they? I think they came out on an original Xbox, right? I can't remember their first console. Maybe it was PS2? I can't remember. I think it was Xbox. Woof! Yeah, I've played most of the Castlevania games. Or I, I actually didn't play a lot of the handheld ones. But non-handheld, yeah. I can't see. But if I turn on my light, the enemies will attack me. Ugh. Nice. Yeah, I hear the handheld games are awesome. I've watched a lot of them too. Symphony of the Night's my favorite Castlevania. And then after that, honestly, probably Castlevania 64. <laughs> Oh yeah, Marco. I forget what I was playing though.
Yeah, I don't know if I'd rather a Symphony Night remake, because if they remade it, Castlevania would be that one. Or just new games. It's hard to say. That argument, or that, that debate is a huge one where it's like, you'll see people on the internet saying, getting like angry at RE4 Remake, like, make new RE games, and then you ask them what they think of Seven and Village, and they're like, oh, I didn't play them, they looked like shit. It's like, okay, you'd rather them release games you'll never play rather than remake something that you love. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I, I assume Konami's gonna make some more games again. Oh my god. Now that all those Silent Hills are announced. Where is this? Okay. Oof. Yeah, Capcom is doing it really well. I like that they're doing remakes and continue to make new games. So, like for Resident Evil, I just want to see a new outbreak. That's the only thing I like overly care about. What I, whatever they do beyond that, bring it on. They gotta be make. They have to be working on Bloodborne too. Like, come on. We have to watch a bit of this cutscene because it's just too good. Uh, 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 oh! uh, uh, Sybil. Wake up. Snap out of it. Snap out of it. Sybil. Harry. <laughs> what happened? So this is a glitch. Shh, don't talk. Obviously. I'll take care of you. Um, if you use the unknown liquid Harry. on the shadow babies, it thinks you used it on injured Sybil and teleports you to the cutscene. I don't think that's an unpopular opinion. I mean, Elden Ring is very... Like, Elden Ring is pretty similar to Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3. So, like, if someone's like, Oh, I like Elden Ring more than the first few, three Dark Souls games. Like, that's that's fair. I'm being summoned. I mean, it's as big as all three of them combined, basically. Um... But Elden Ring isn't similar to Bloodborne. Like, yeah, it plays the same way, but they're... Bloodborne... It's a lot different aesthetic than the other Souls games. I think Bloodborne's still my favorite. I do love Elden Ring. I like Sekiro. I think Sekiro is like a god tier game. I really enjoyed playing it. Um, but I just wasn't a fan of the, like, I don't like how you had to use the same weapon the entire game. And the talents just felt like they did nothing. And not saying it's bad. It's fine. It's just not like 
the way they went about that game wasn't exactly for me in particular. The aspects of the game weren't bad, it's just I prefer like being able to switch weapons and make my own build and stuff and couldn't really do that in uh, Sekiro. And yeah, no fashion. But as a game, it was it was really, really, really well made and, and awesome. Yeah, I've always wanted to play the Neo games. I might one day. Cry, guys. They won't bring her back. Yo, crowing. Mm. Dino Crisis 3. Like, I, I want to play it. It's just... Like... It works like shit on emulator, apparently. And... Oh god, I forget this. Oh no, no, oh no, 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 no. I need- oh god. If we don't YOLO this, I might have to look it up. Oh boy, here we go. Oh man. Just please. Brain, please just fucking have this down. Come on. Fuck, dude. Uh. Something like this. Something like this, guys. It's something like this. I just forget what the... I just forget. I just forget. Can't be this, is it? Maybe it is. Oop. Okay, wait. Here we go. Here we go. No! Thank you. Thank you. Beep, 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 beep. I always forget about that one. Uh, two. Thank you, helpers. I, this happens every time. It's just I find it so hard to remember. I love Dragonflight. Yeah, it's awesome. I don't think there's any like really good objective criticism of Dragonflight. It's just uh, it's the same old tale of most people that play WoW are tired of WoW and they don't want to admit that to themselves. So they'll just rag on an expansion instead. Yeah, I can't fucking wait for a Diablo 4. Yo, Solid Snake. Yo, Chaotic.
when you see I don't even have to look at the clock when you see a lot of highs in the chat that means it's close to the hour It is kind of stale. I'm super fucking pumped for D4. I hear people weren't happy with the last Path of Exile uh, patch. Ugh! Shit. I was gonna heal, but I don't need to. Yeah, see, it keeps things interesting. Mm. Yeah, Diablo 2 uh, rem or Rebirth, whatever it was called, was awesome. I streamed that for like 60 hours. <laughs> I don't know what to expect from D4. I don't really like. I don't. I don't have like neg negative expectations in in my head. It's just you know, as long as I get like 10, 20, 30, 40 hours out of it, whatever. I would like to get hundreds, but we'll see. Freeze! Who are you? <gasps> oh. Ooh, sorry about that, babe. And oh, uh, oh shit! Run! God, I thought we were fighting the demon boss. Oops. What? Thank you, B, for the raid. How was the rest of Mega Man X3? I think I'm gonna tr play Mega Man next, or this weekend. It just looks so fun. Die, you piece of shit. Why? Why? <laughs> well. Red of ammo. But Silent Hill has an amazing built-in feature. Oh, uh, unless I die. Sorry, it does a lot of damage. I have to check my health. Silent Hill has an amazing built-in feature. Where, if you run out of ammo, the boss will just eventually die to natural causes. <laughs> Daddy. That's not a glitch or anything. That's, like, Cheryl. fucking genius in my opinion. Thank you, Daddy. Um... Yeah, that's awesome. I, I love Mega Man X3. Well, 1 through 3. I'm afraid to revisit X2 because I consider it my favorite, but I feel like when I go back, I might not. Can't leave like this. Thank you, Sroot. This can't be happening. Yeah, like the end. Cheryl? Yeah. Cheryl. Cheryl. Uh sort of Goku, yeah. Yeah, it's been fun watching you play Mega Man. Those are pretty tough games. What is Legends? 
There's a rumor Final Fantasy X 3 is coming. It's a rumor. I would fucking love a prequel with Braska, Orin, and um, Jacked. That'd be so sick. There's a bunch of Final Fantasy rumors though. Like 9 Remake is coming. Yeah, don't put any thought into those by the way. They're just rumors to give you a smile, basically. And then if you take them serious, they'll make you depressed. Uh, but... <sighs> Killing Sin was a mistake though, so... Thank you, B. Make sure to follow Room B, guys. Is this gonna work? No, it's not. I like that streamer. Ah, uh, only hipster. Only. I think they just... FF9 is a perfect game for a remake. Like, it'd be so interesting to see what they would do. Just graphically, I mean. Well, yeah, si I, like six stuff. The reason I don't think six is gonna get remade is because it's definitely the most ambitious one. I, I think they'd have to create two worlds. So, and all the playable characters, like they have to build like what is it like twenty one or I don't know the number. It's like, I guess I could think of them all, but. I think 6 would be the best. If like every Final Fantasy game was in good graphics and modernized in the same way FF7 is, all in one part, I think 6 would be... Actually, maybe one of the classics would be really good too. Go. I don't know. All the Final Fantasy games are good. Or mostly all of them. Do do best part. Mm -hmm. Oh god, I have to find Dino Crisis on my desktop. I do not want to play Final Fantasy XII at all. I have never played that game. It's just so unappealing to me. I don't know what it is. The game in general. Okay, I'm playing Dino Crisis, people! Uh, here it is. I think I play this on mouse and keyboard. I 
I think. Oh, one sec. I actually have to find... I can't run this game without notes because there's like 30... or There's like 28 passwords in the game or something. Uh, they're around here somewhere. I found him. We're doing it. Okay. Do you like to use the infrared ammo of a rocket launcher? You have mail. Do I? Dino Crisis. Now that's a game that needs a remake. Okay. This is the first checkpoint. Playtime is officially over, kiddies. Something's wrong. The lights in the guardhouse are out. Um, maybe this has been a wild night of partying for the guards. I think it looks awesome. You know, I can't wait for Final Fantasy 16. Stay here, Junior. Stay here, Junior. Leave the guards to me. Um... Judging from the interview... Hey. Did you hear what he just called me? Judging from the interview Forget they released about Silent Hill 2 Remake that we watched this. earlier before the marathon, it, I would, I take that as right. they are using Silent Hill 2 to test the waters, and then they'll probably just remake Silent Hill 1 and 3. Because Silent Hill 1, if you're going to remake Silent Hill 1, you sort of have to do 3, because it's like a direct sequel and it, it, it got good reviews and everything, you know, people would beg for it. Okay. So if Silent Hill 2 did badly, I'll like the actual the best Silent Hill game, the then there's no chance the 1 and 3 would sell well. So may as well start off with the strongest one that is its own there. game. Like Silent Hill 2 is a standalone you. game that doesn't connect to the other Silent Hill, Hill games. So I think that's why they snubbed uh, Silent Hill 1. If you want Silent Hill 1 Remake, buy Silent Hill 2 Remake, basically. Because I think you'll get Let it. Let me guess. This is some of your handiwork, right? The brass is still warm. The brass is still warm. These guards were shooting at something very recently. Thank so you, Hatsion. This wasn't much of a fight. Yeah, look, guys, we have Bakking. I don't think these guards hit anything before getting sliced and diced. I'm talking through the game. Whatever they were shooting at came in through there and ripped right through the steel fence. Well, the hole is nice and clean, but I still say you could have done this. Very funny. Speaking about games with long ass still intros. Still need to figure out what happened here. Continue to sweep the area. All right, so now we gotta go get our mop and broom and sweep up all these bullets and stuff. My favorite part of the game. Oh shit! What do I have? Quick turn bound to. We're about to find out. I hope we're about to find out. You. Boop boop. Rick here. I'm in. The place is deserted though. I have a very bad speak it in that this. game looks awesome but I've never How's played the progress it going with that security system I don't know what's been going on here but it looks like all the power in this facility has been cut God. same here as long as that's the situation yeah that's a rune B game right there I can do. why don't you see if you can gain access to the backup generators on the ground I'm level. on it I'm on it what are you doing here I caught the last part of your conversation. By the way, I found a key. Hand it over. Yeah, maybe I'll Let's try the remasters. Outside. I forgot they were coming. We'll see. It's games like that I always hope for sponsors. I have a sponsor for Persona this week. Uh, for either three or four, I can play whichever one I want. I don't know which one I want to play though. That's disgusting. This guy's been eviscerated. Something tore his intestines straight out. 
Look at those tooth marks. It had to be some sort of animal. Okay, let's move on. Move on. Wait, 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 does Persona, do they both have voice acting or both don't have voice acting? Gail? Both have, oh, okay. But yeah, the thing that excites me most about FF16 is that my favorite part of that franchise has always been the summons and a game revolving around them. Hell yeah, dude. I hope it plays like Goman's Great Adventure. I mean, with the with the battling. <laughs> Yeah, she's got the bone pistol. By the way, I'm running the category called No Weapon. Some kind of dinosaur. <laughs> now that's a good one. So, who was it? Barney? This isn't a joke, you idiot. We were just attacked by a big ass lizard. For real? What's going on over there? Uh, all right. Sorry. Head over to the control room and we'll sort out this whole situation. I'm staying quiet this time because last time we played, I just repeated all the lines. Yeah, I wish Final Fantasy XIV was more accessible, or not so much accessible, but I wish it wasn't such a grind to get to the content. It's one thing I love about Blizzard games. Usually, like if a game's like three, four, or five years in, it takes like <laughs> ten minutes to get to the current content. And other games like, nah, no, 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 you got like five hundred hours of hard grinding to do. What's our status? This security system is a snap for me. Real amateur stuff. So, oh. so what exactly happened to Gale? You said that he was attacked by a dinosaur? Yeah. Yeah. I couldn't believe it. I just hope he's still alive. Anyway, our first priority is to complete the mission. Guys, take a guess why this game will never get into GDQ. Get off this death trap. That's a great idea, but Cooper has the radio and he's missing. Hey, what's with this monitor? Hey, what's with this monitor? That's the security monitor for the underground. Uh, you get free boosts with like every everything. 
So I take it that means power still hasn't been restored to the area. Exactly. They must and have even without a boost, you, you level like at an insane speed. Level. We can investigate that area after we finished our sweep of the ground level. Okay, then I'll take care of the shutters that are blocking the way. You work your way in, grab the dock, and then rendezvous back here. Yeah. Now what I want to know is where those things are coming from. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I need to play Nocturne. I watched Failmore play a little bit of it. I can sadly recite every line in this game. His cutscenes aren't skippable, so I've watched them like 50 times. <laughs> Uh, on the 19th, I think, Joel. Uh... Oh, it's not probably Any game- I- I- Unskippable cutscenes are an objectively bad thing. Ready? That was quick. Thanks. Hey girl, just get going. Hey girl, just get going. Mm. A muck. D dude, d wait. I've never watched someone play a muck without them playing music over it. Does that game have a soundtrack? Or... No. Look, you can see, you can see Regina in the reflection, like really far away for some reason. Watch, in the door. Here it comes, here she is. <laughs> uh, no. I didn't even know what the weather was like outside. The we oh, actually, yeah, the weather's been fucking garbage here lately. It's super snowed. And right after it was done snowing a ton, it did icy rain, and then I woke up and it was snowing again, and then I looked outside and it was raining again, and the street is just, like, ice. I keep meaning to go get my mail, but, uh... Yeah. It's just, like, pure ice out there. Uh, wait, is this head or newcomer? I think it's head. Oh! Oh shit, me clicking off actually stops the game. Sorry, I had to do something. A survivor! A survivor? Are you from the rescue team? Uh, I... Yes, yes I am. Do you know where I can find... Kirk! Kirk! That fool. That fool. What's he plotting now? Kirk. What are you talking about? Here. Take this. What's this for? I, I don't know. Extremely Tell vital. Me. Extremely vital. Great acting. Damn. It's sketchy.
Thank you, Charles. Oh, my plushie's almost done, speaking of that. Everyone it always asks. Be somewhere near the it's almost done. The training room. So I actually I think it might be done. Well, I was just sent the last... Um... Chet! I was just sent an update about it today, before my stream, and I didn't have enough time to think if I was happy with it or not, so I... Decided to respond later, but I think it's good. It's a different one from the last. The last one's like God fucking knows where that is. The guys who made it like wiped off the face of the planet. I still don't have. By the way, that old plushie that I was gonna release, the one I showed you guys many times, uh, I'm still waiting for mine. They said they were gonna send me one, and it's like long gone. Uh, they said they were gonna send me one. Like, God, when was that? Last June? They're like, oh, it's on the way! Like, okay, sick. Uh... Letting Twitch chat decide anything creative you're going to release, like an idea, an emote, or a, uh... Or a, uh... Fucking... Merch is a horrific idea. Because there's always discourse. Gale, you're but I've done alive. it a few times. Good timing. Fun. What is it? Another lizard? That's no lizard. It's a dinosaur. 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 Look, something's really wrong. With creative with stuff, just ask yes, whole man. Mission has gone south. Like, oh, is this cool? Yep. Hey, it's always eat or be eaten out in the battlefield. No matter who or what you're I showed my friends the last plushie design. Any word on the dock yet? Horrible idea, by the way. And all of them that different I've things. I've got to hook up with Rick again. My radio's dead. I'm just like, alright, I'm asking other people. It. Let's get out of here. One great thing about the Dino Crisis speedrun is everyone gets to see the entire story. Left, center, right, left, center, left. I have so, no clue. Do we have power yet? We're in the green, thanks to you. Look, I need you to come back here. There's something I have to talk to you about. I wish there was a single god tier dinosaur game. That's single player. Ark is the only one that's actually like amazing, but. <clears throat> Hopefully Ark 2 will be our savior. Yeah, Turok. That game has like three dinosaurs. 
Great game, though. Turok on GameCube? That's called Turok Evolution. That game is horrific. I bought Turok Evolution on release day. One of the most disappointing days of my life. Actually, I, I haven't told this story in a long time. Me and my brother, my oldest brother were looking for that game. It was sold out like everywhere. I found it first. He basically pushed me down. Took my money. Wait, 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 wait. This is not the correct way. I'm bad. I, I was like so confused as I was running to this door. Like, this is it. We're very close to the right way, though. Yeah, he took my copy, threw money at me. Anyway, we found another copy, and we both got home and played it, and woof. Game is a nightmare. I need to stream that game, though. That'd be fun. No, it was my other brother. What's the emergency? Gail just told me he saw someone on the underground monitor. Flash by pretty quick. But he's sure he Flash saw by something. Pretty quick. But I'm sure I saw something. Rick, open the shutter to the underground area. What? What is it? It's a distress signal from one of our team members. Uh-oh. It must be Cooper. Yeah, or it might be Tom. He infiltrated this facility posing as one of the researchers. Can you pinpoint the signal? It's coming from outside of the building. To the east of the rear entrance we came in from. <laughs> Look, we'll deal with it later. Our first priority is the survivor in the underground. It could be the doc. What are you talking about? He's asking for our help. We, we don't, don't leave, leave our, our own behind. behind. And what if it's, and what a, trap? If it's a trap? Would you want one of us to come and rescue you? Don't bother. I'm willing to take that risk. Remember our mission. We're not here to babysit. That's your way of operating. Not mine. mine. Yeah, how do- Hey, B, are you still here? Alright. You have your access to the underground, Gale. Gale. So get moving. You handle your things your way. I I'll handle, handle my things way. my way. That little fuck is really starting to get on my nerves. That punk is really starting to get on my nerves. Regina? Regina? I'm heading out to investigate the underground. Gina? Give me those lingerie pics of Rick. I'll be right back. I hope in the remake they're a couple. Look at those compies eating that raptor's butt. Yeah, oh yeah, they're amazing. I love the AI in Turok Evolution. How, like, every enemy can just get stuck and spam gibberish. That's my favorite part. Dr. Kirk? Hey, wait! Hey, wait! Wow. Regina, are you there? What's going on? I have a positive ID on the doctor. I lost him, but he's definitely in the lab area. Okay. Drop what you're doing and get over here. I can see an elevator from here. Maybe I can use that to go down from the first floor. Yeah, what crack were they on when they made Exo Primal, really, though? God, that's so stupid. What a waste of time. Did 
It just pains me to see a company like be so so disconnected with the community that they waste time on things like resistance and reverse and exo primal like thinking in their head like oh yeah this is gonna be good people are gonna love this like oh my god yeah it's fine it, like they should get a piece of that that gaming pie but or the online pie but i mean holy shit at least do some research like they're at the they're at the point of so many disastrous releases for online games this they should just literally be like hey community what do you guys want to see for online games and enjoy seeing fucking no one say things like reverse resistance or exo primal Exo in in Exo Primal's defense, it's probably the best one of the three. But still, it's like Oh shit, wait. I almost went the wrong way. Here, I'll give you something that would sell fucking ten times better. It would sell ten times more than all three of those shit games combined. DLC for RE2 Remake, where you could play as the, one of the police officers online with a friend or many friends, with many unlockable police officers or costumes or whatever else. Call of Duty Zombies, but over the shoulder with RE2 Remake gameplay. Extra weapons, yada yada yada. There. A simple idea that requires like five employees a couple months and you've got yourself something far fucking better than any of that garbage. Rick here. I found Tom. And or it's not garbage. I said I that too late. that was mean, but I enjoyed make. resistance and reverse like for a couple you days, did what you but could. Like god damn. Right now. I'm going to continue working on the system. Yeah, I wonder if Dead Rising will ever make a return. We're gonna get picked up! Yeah, Frankles, I know. You should have seen my face. Oh, well, I mean, there's clips everywhere, but... I was doing a sponsored RE stream by Capcom. When that got announced, like, streaming it. Uh... I couldn't believe it. Because they... There was leaked that there was gonna be an online RE shown. And I'm just like, you know, after you release so many fucking garbage games, online ones, you think you learned something. And no. They didn't sell well, they weren't received well, they were like... God, it's like nothing was good. Quality game, sure, <clears throat> but oh my god. <clears throat> I think, like, the wolf. Here's the problem with the reverse updates. I said this the other day, but the Wolfhound Squad is really cool. Like, Chris's squad, you know, yada yada yada. It's really, really cool, and I'm sure they're all great characters, but all of them with their gear on and their headsets on and shit, they may as well just all be the same fucking person. They don't talk either. It's like, you're just releasing the same character six times and calling it content. No one wants those fucking characters. It should have been one character with five different skins or however many there are, but no, they're just, they're just like, but I don't, it's hardly even a topic to discuss because... Reverse is the definition of an asset flip, so it's like, whatever.
I mean, yeah, that'd be sick, Resident Evil fan. I mean, yes, I'm always in favor of something the community actually enjoys. But like, again, here's a, here's a massive problem with mercenaries. So mercenaries wasn't received too well in... All right, rewind a sec. They put mercenaries in village because people were so mad it wasn't a three remake and people were very vocal about how they wanted mercenaries to come back. So they added it into village and it wasn't received well and not a lot of people played it. And then they put the update on and still not a lot of people played it. So now Capcom thinks, oh shit, I guess they didn't really want mercenaries. It's probably just a vocal minority. But no, the problem it did badly, or the, the reason it did badly is because it wasn't mercenaries. It was more like raid mode. It's like people want mercenaries and you gave us like a downgraded like raid mode from Revelations. So the problem is that they didn't really give us mercenaries. They just gave us something very strange and yeah. Like, it's called Mercenaries. Because you get to play as many different people. And they released it with just Ethan. No loadouts or nothing. You had to buy your weapons and you were not allowed to have certain weapons in certain levels. Like, it took away a lot of your freedom. Um, shit, I always forget how to do this. I I enjoyed playing through mercenaries. Like I think they they did a decent job with it, but I don't think it's what everyone wanted. I just think it was another huge disconnect on Capcom's part where it's like they released something that was fun to do and fun to complete, but it what, did it have the true nature of mercenaries that people know and love? Absolutely not. But we had this discussion just a couple days ago. The reason RE8 was, like, the replay value and stuff was not there is... because they tagged on reverse. That's why when you beat the game, there's, like, nothing much else to do. In comparison to two remake, uh, it's this way. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Six is the longest RE. No questions asked about that. Yeah, I watched Last of Us. It was awesome. Well, Village is... Yes, Village is one of the longest RE games, but post-game content is almost non-existent. I mean, compared to 2 Remake... I, we, we just had this discussion many times. I mean, we do every day almost, but... Here's what you do after you beat... Here's what the, the devs wanted you to do after you beat... Village. Quit out of the game and boot up reverse. Where when when Capcom made RE2 Remake, what they wanted you to do when you beat the game is beat the other three scenarios, beat Hunk, beat all seven Tofus, then go beat the four Forgotten scenarios, and then have so much fun with all that shit that you go back and beat it four more times again. Or, when you go back and beat it again, you're trying to get S plus rank. There's like so many reasons to replay RE2 Remake. The biggest reason being because it's fun. Um, yeah, there's so many unlockables. But there's no true replayability in Village besides like using the lightsaber and stuff. 
Uh... Like, replayability is different than having a game that's fun to play again. Reasons to play again plus being fun is the ultimate. Like, I consider RE2 Remake to be one of the most replayable games ever. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I played Parasite Eve a few times. I used to speedrun it, actually. I, I love that game. Yo, Lime, thank you. Shit. Yeah, and then you have RE4, like, oh my god, man. So a lot of people, RE4 is like their most played RE, let's just say that. But there's a lot of people that it is their most. And it doesn't really have replayability, it's just that fun. It's so fun that you just want to go back and play it right away. Um, I hope they can nail, I hope... God, my ultimate wish is that RE4 is like the best RE game ever, or RE4 Remake. And to do that, it needs to be... It needs to have all the, all the pluses of RE1 Remake and RE2 Remake. Which RE1 Remake is just have everything the original had and better. Or just there in general and still good. Uh... Um... Thank you, Callie. Oh, nice, nice. Glad you enjoyed. Thank you, thank you. I like this song. I don't think uh, RE4 needs to add more scenarios like RE2 Remake or RE2 in general. It just needs to have fun little challenges and achievements that give you unlockables when you beat the game. Like S Plus was fucking genius from Capcom. It's really weird how they just ditched that for 3 and 8. God, you add you add a letter and a plus sign, two guns attached to it, and you got yourself you got people playing the game twice as much. Like god damn. I don't know how on earth they didn't do it again. Like Jesus Christ. Regina? I finally made it to the entrance of the doctor's lab. Work. Yeah, it's, it's like so it weird. It's like working in tandem to unlock it. I love Good Capcom night. and You're they've right done there. nothing but good things recently, but it's so weird that they always fall so, into this pattern where status? they'll get they'll knock Here, something out of the this. park and then they'll Ready? not use it again. And then they'll do something horrible okay. like Umbrella Corp and do it again One, and again and again and two, again. And it's just like three. guys, you do something awesome, get so much praise for it. Then never do it again, and you do something terrible, get so much hate for it, and you do it all the time. Like, what is wrong with you? It's just, it's, it's probably just a matter of too many people in the room talking about too many different ideas, and then just gets lost in the hustle. I like... Everything to do with the merchant in RE4 original, just not the rocket launcher. The rocket launcher is just a very imbalanced weapon. You buy it to kill bosses, and then when you kill the boss, it pays for the next one, here. and then some. Why? This just operation bad balance. is taking way too long already. Warning: the emergency system has been activated. 
emergency lockdown in progress. What's going on? Oh, Kirk must have tripped off the security system. That fool. What's your status, Regina? I'm reading. Thank you, Dragon. We're trapped inside here. Kirk must have triggered it off. We didn't touch anything. Can you clear it? I'll see what I can do. What's wrong with this thing? Oh. Cool it, Gale. We'll find a way out somehow. Yeah, I just hope it's they use everything they've learned in for. Like hardest difficult hardest difficulty, no no viable rocket launcher, ink ribbons to save, or something else. No super forgiving checkpoints, no Warning. No, what's it called? Has been bypassed. You D have uh, uh, difficulty this adjustment. Until this section no DI off. bullshit. We'd better get moving. We bypassed the Just door. Just do worry to remake. That's great, but the entire underground area is crawling with dinosaurs. You'll never be able to make it through there. D A. Yeah, oops. Don't sweat it. I'll take them all out one by one if I have to. Brilliant plan, fearless leader, but I have a better one. These readouts tell me there's I gotta activate DA again, probably. You should be able to make a clean break through there. Are you sure? Yeah, but there's one problem. Uh oh. The hatch is password locked through the mother system. Forget, Forget it. it. If you, you can't, can't crack, crack the code before, before the dinosaurs, dinosaurs rush in, we'll be completely trapped. I know. You just have to trust me. I don't. I don't. Fine. What about you? Make your choice. Make your choice. Gale. Bum ba dum bum ba dum bum. I do think they'll bring back outbreak. Yeah. <laughs> RE4 was actually the first RE to have difficulty adjustment. <laughs> so we'll see. Thank you, Chicago Outfit. I don't think there's anything wrong with DA. I actually don't. I think it's fine to have in games because no one even notices it and it just helps people through the game. Where I have a problem with it is when it's on the hardest difficulty. It's like you're choosing the hardest difficulty for a fucking reason. You're not choosing it to like breeze through the game. You're choosing it for a challenge. Why defeat that challenge if you're having trouble with the challenge, you know? Like de defeats the entire purpose of a harder difficulty. Gale! You're a lucky guy, Doc. So this must be the elusive Thank you. Dr. Die. Kirk. The bathroom, one sec. Yeah. Gave us quite a run for our money. You get around, don't you? Just like a rat. And you got this whole island set up as your little maze. Well, I am glad I kept you entertained, tough guy. Shut up. I'm surprised they sent someone after me. I had heard they reported me as deceased. If that's the way you want it, I'd be more than happy to oblige. So what'll it be, genius? Relax, Agent. My study is nearing its final stages. Magnificent, isn't it? But I can't leave before I've analyzed the final results. I don't give spit about your results. I'm taking you back under orders, so shut up and follow me. Regina, locate the communication facility and call in the extraction chopper. You can't do this! I have rights! According to command, your government property, I mean, pal. I suggest you take it up with them. No! no! They can't do this to me! They deserted me three years ago and now they want me back? This is preposterous! Shut up. Then shoot me, idiot, you lame, flat-top, jaw-headed... Shut up. Where's the communication room? Just point your gun at him. Oi. Shut up. Take the elevator up. 
from the control room. I need a card to access that elevator. He's Kirking. I know you've got one. Hand it over, Doc. You bastard! Fine. So, we're all set then. I mean, you can stealth we'll and meet remake, you at the so... Hey, wait, where are you going? Oh. I have a little unfinished business to take unfinished care of. Unfinished business? I'll drop this guy off with Rick. Now get moving. Unfinished business? I think Plutonius is tied with the original. But clearly you don't have to kill everything in 4 Remake because there's a stealth option, so... Be doo doo, be doo doo, be doo doo, be doo doo, be doo doo. Oh, there's a few. Dino Crisis actually has a lot of unique sound effects, but it's definitely a few. That one might be for Murray. Oops. Freeze. Who are you? Ah. Oh. Sorry about that, babe. Thank you, Falmore. How was your stream? What are we up to? What dinosaur game? We like dinosaur games here. Thank you, Nintendo. Thank you for the 48. Nice to see you, sir. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed Ray's stream last Gina, night. It was epic. The emergency lock on the He's a bit busy right now. Just been I'm a bit busy right now. Do something about it. Don't sweat it. I'll release the lock. Oh, nice. Oh, I can't wait for the boxes with the yellow tape. It's open. You're all clear. Thank you, Grav. I'm gonna take this cheerful sandwich. Regina, do you copy? Finally. I'll give you the abridged version. Da, 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 Mission da, da, da. Scrub the initial plans and pick us up at the heliport immediately. The heliport? This entire island's a bloodbath. Bloodbath. The only survivor not on the team is the doctor. I'll give you the details later. Just Minecraft? get back no. here and pick us up ASAP. Roger, I'm on my way. The only games I plan to speed in the next few months are RE4 Remake and Dead Space Remake. Regina, Hopefully, if it's a good speedrun. The chopper's on its way here. Great. Don't waste any time. And remember, use the main entrance to get to the heliport. I'll definitely play through Dead Space more than once. Because uh, I want to beat the hardest difficulty. And I'm not starting on the one that has permadeath, obviously. Do 
Pepper giggles, yeah. Playing Hogwarts off stream. I mean, I wouldn't play it out. I'd just stream it. Uh oh. Streams Hogwarts is getting cancelled. Watch out. You bought this video game and played it? Well, you're a horrific person. I really hope this cutscene skip. Holy shit. If this game got remade, this part would get scrapped. This is such a weird room to have in a part that's supposed to be like urgent. Hogwarts, guys. Don't do it. Okay, Regina? Isn't Harry Potter for kids anyway? Where's Gale? Aren't video games for kids? I don't know. Haven't heard a word from Checkmate. Him. What's he doing? Finally. You know, I had a really bad feeling about this mission. All things considered, it could have been a lot worse. Thank you, Curse, for the 13 months. Thought, something must have those animals spooked. Streaming Harry Potter, well, for anyone that does, or if I do too, it's going to be interesting because if anyone is in your chat hating on you for playing the game, they're also supporting the game by being in your chat, so it'll be pretty ironic. Dr. Kirk! I like how people give so less of a shit that it's like, you know, mentioning some stuff usually gets chat in an uproar, but yeah, and that's a great approach to it, Sophistic. It, like you. I think if you don't want to support something and you think it's morally wrong or against what you believe in, do that. That's fucking awesome power to you. Makes people less of a robot and a zombie. I think the problem arises when other people start to attack other people because they're not doing what they do. Like the whole fucking holier than thou approach on all this bullshit is sickening. I fucking hate going on Twitter and reading people like talking about how my- oh you support Hogwarts, I'm on following you, or you're unblocking you. It's like, dude, you better be a fucking vegan that doesn't shop at any big brand grocery stores that just gets rid of food and slowly kills the fucking planet. Because you're getting mad at someone that has used bad words against a, a group of people 
when you support actually ruining the goddamn planet. On top of that, it's like, that is why I fucking hate the holier than thou approach, because most people preaching that kind of shit are in no stance to do that. And tweeting from an iPhone, yes. Yeah, supporting Apple. It's like, trust me, if you guys want to play whatever game you want to play, whether it's a Blizzard game, Hogwarts, or whatever company people are fucking, the next company people are hating on, you have to remember that all there's all these people that worked on the game, there's all these people that work at the company that have nothing to do with that shit. They're just trying to make a living doing what they, they love doing, which Regina, is making games or playing here. games or whatever else. And when you're trying to like, just destroy the lives of all those people, just to not give one person 10 cents. It's just dumb. I hate it. I hate holier than thou. We're screwed. The preaching. chopper's history. How are we gonna get out of here? Calm down. We'll just have to find another way. Ma, oh, come off it. You're never this positive. Huh? What? What happened? But man. I almost want to stream the game just to have those arguments with people and debates. Of like, oh, I can't believe you're doing this. All right, to that person's mm. social media. Let's see if they're vegan first shot. off. We'll Do they have they ever way. played a Blizzard game in the past year? Okay, there we go. God, it pisses me off so much. But I'm all for not supporting horrible people. It's when you attack other people for that. You're just adding to the fucking problem. I'm not saying J.K. Rowling is a good person. This is beyond J.K. Rowling. It's about any issue. I don't even I don't even think of JK Rowling when I think Harry Potter. I've never read the books, never planned to. I didn't even know who the fuck she was You're until a few yet. years ago. Like what I've heard mean? the name obviously, but I like have never looked her up or anything. Let's get moving. So I think I found a way out of here. Right on, girl. Let's hear it. But just like when that game comes out. If you're if you're a Twitch streamer that hasn't quit your job, you're supporting her by being on this platform that promotes the game, that gives her money. It's like you could go deep down this fucking hole and realize that like when you're attacking okay, other people now what? in this kind of subject, you're almost always in the fucking wrong. Yeah. Then let's do it. Hurry. I'm worried it's about Just about dinner. making your own choices Our and your own beliefs. Leader, fine. And not being bullied into out. someone else doing something because they got bullied. You, my outfit. I feel like I am pretty rational about this subject. Uh, like I, I feel like this is one of those things where, uh, this piece of junk must like having a, a different opinion. This is just insane to me. And by on? that, just to be more know. clear, it's like having Dale? a different opinion is in thinking we should attack people, yeah. like Get attack individuals, cancel them for Gail, it looks like there's a whatever. Nearby. There's got to be a ship we can use. Copy. Leave Kirk to me. You two get the power back online and secure our escape route. Roger. Thank you, Frosty, for the 50 months. Thank you. Well, yeah, it's just a massive problem with social media, Neo, where when you, you have these minorities of, like... I, this sucks out with these issues as a white male, <laughs> by the way. And I feel like I'll just get cancelled for that very thing. Uh, but you have these minorities all the time on the internet where one person will speak up and say, we don't like this. Like, like I'm white, so I'll use myself as an example. I'm white. So when someone like, what the? 
this batter is completely When dead. says someone on the internet says something offends me, I'll go on and be like, us white males, we don't like that. Never ever say that again. We hate that. When in reality, like 99.9% .9 of white males like myself are like, wait, what the fuck is he talking about? But then that tweet goes viral of that dipshit saying something everyone hates, but no one actually hates it. It's like, that's the, just social media. Jesus Christ, it's horrible. Let people speak for themselves. And speak for yourself. Perfect. This is all Don't just we need drag everyone about. down with you. I thought all Canadians were nice. Hey, fuck you! Just like, it's so f- oh god. Just nuts. It's nuts. I'll work on the security system. You handle our escape route. Saying like, I just hate when it's like, someone is this, so they're that. Oh, you're American? You must like guns. Oh, you're Canadian? You must like maple syrup. By the way, these things don't piss me off. It's just when people get angry at other people, like, you know. But yeah, to, just to go full circle, the reason we're talking about this, that we're, I'm down this bunny hole. If you play Harry Potter, you are going to be called a transphobe from people. And that's all there is to it. When I think of this subject, I always go... My mind typically goes towards, like, um, ah, it doesn't matter, actually. Beep, beep, beep. Ah, uh, uh-oh. Up, hook, down, left, release. I know, I can't remember the last time I got in an argument with, like, a singular person on the internet. Holy fuck. It blows my mind seeing that shit happen online. Bum ba da bum bum. I always just want to see what the kind of the malicious kind of people I'm referring to. I always want to see what they would do if something their entire like life got like what they support got cancelled. Just see what they would do. I remember when Blizzard, like when the, all the Blizzard stuff happened and the sexual allegations started, yada yada yada, and people were coming out of it like, if you play a Blizzard game, I'm unfollowing you or whatever else. Um, I, uh, a lot of these people that talk like this, you'd go to their profile and like their whole being would revolve around like, you know, One Piece or Dragon Ball Z or Valorant or Riot Games or whatever. And I always just think to myself, man, your whole life is built around one thing. One thing that is exactly like this. It's weird to see them speaking out like that. More games need crane sections, yeah. This game has a, reuses a lot of puzzles. Well, yeah, well, on that topic, Riot Games. But see, the, and this is why I care so deeply about uh, what I'm talking about, no one cares about. I'm talking specifically about people that try and 
get angry at other people for not doing exactly what they do. But they, like Riot Games and Blizzard, like Riot Games was canceled a while ago for sexual allegations. But all those people that were mad about it slowly but surely got back into the games. Hmm, that's weird. It's only offensive until it's not trending. Okay, good. Now that I've canceled a bunch of other people, I'm going to start playing Valorant again. Yeah, it isn't consistent, and it's just hypocritical. That's what pisses me off. Not saying I haven't done hypocritical things. I probably do them every fucking day. I change my mind so fast, it would make your head spin on things. But I don't do it to the point that other people's lives are made worse or in danger or, or anything else. It all just revolves around me and my opinions, not like hurting other people. Thank you, Dark and Rose with a 66. Thank you, sir. Nice to see you. How are you doing today? I hope I have a hemostat. <clears throat> Don't start talking about politics. This is nothing to fucking do with politics. I mean, well. Oh my god! He made the ultimate jump. And I'm bleeding again. Oh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Gale! Yeah. Well, at least Kirk's running out of places to hide. Yeah. Yeah. Oops. I still can't see that good take emote. Gotta get that working on my side. Can you guys see it? Uh, maybe, Rose. That's pretty good. I, mean, I think Dino Crisis 2 is really good. This one's pretty good, too. Uh, it's, I just searched it. It's there in the... Regina, uh, I it. extensions the part of Twitch. By the way, no, no, sorry. But why I mentioned like other people's pages are like, oh, they play this game, they worship One Piece. Remember that? It was... So why that matters is, fuck, I'm losing my train of thought because I'm trying to remember the game. <laughs> ah, something remind me of what I was gonna say. Uh. Fuck. Oh, 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 oh. They like speak the on these games the and these comics or movies or, or things that are getting canceled because they would never fucking play them anyway. It, and hmm. I just want to see what would happen Take if something they actually like summer. gets canceled. You copy, Mike? It's always people that don't give a fuck a about the I actual thing. Elevator. Huh, 
Sounds like we're not the only ones having problems. I'm glad you're amused. But if that guy gets eaten, we're going to have to retrieve the key from that dinosaur's stomach. You've got to save him. It's always Regina. It's always me. Man, I want to see Regina in the RE engine. Height ism? Oh. Yeah, Dead by Daylight. Oh. <laughs> Dead by Daylight <laughs> is probably weirdly enough. What a what a freaking enigma Dead by Daylight is. It's probably like the game that gets the most drama that I can think of. Oh no, dude, this is just such a bad setup. And I'm bleeding. This is horrible. I don't even know what you guys- what, what do you mean heightism? Is that what women who won't date men who aren't six feet? Is that what you're referring to? Because trust me, if you're talking about that, who gives a fuck about someone like that? They're a terrible person anyway, who cares? I mean, they're not a terrible person anyway, but you know, it's like... If someone is so superficial that no matter what, your height is all that matters, who cares? You don't want that person in your life. Height is- oh, you're talking about an actual thing. Height is like going through school and shit. I see. Yeah, hey, I know it's real. It's very- you can tell from a very early age, heightism is real. I didn't know it was an actual word now, but I mean, I had a, a science teacher who was like two feet tall and fucking everyone made fun of her and just like made her life a living hell. I mean, yeah, I, I knew that already, but I didn't know what you're referring to, honestly. <laughs> Oh, I see. Well, heightism isn't trending, so I don't give a fuck. Just kidding, I'm pretending to be most people that talk about this shit like it's their life. Thank you, Garrus. Uh, this way. I'm still bleeding. Oh my god. Stop. Stop. Yikes, dude. Oh, this is so bad. And he's gonna be right at the corner, isn't he? Yep. Oh my god. This hallway exists to make people rent the game more than once. This is fucking horrible. Oh no! Oh, thank god. God, this is like the lab has been so bad. Fast. Yes. I mean, yeah. I, I, I mean, I don't know what you're trying to say. I don't know if you're like, you know, I don't. Um. What I don't think there's a problem. Oh, I mean, when it comes to a partner, who cares? Like. I saw something like this in Kirk's personal uh, lab. Yeah, never attack someone for this could be a their height or sex or race or whatever. You know. This vortex must be the side effect of the third Makes energy you a mean experiment. person. Yeah, sure, sure. 
And with the just rewind time for a sec. It's rewind time. So uh, we're I. To get this thing. Either we find a way, or we. Yeah, I said fuck those people problems. that care about your height. Not funny. Okay. And don't date I'll you or whatever because of how tall or computer. short you are. Uh, Regina, yeah, I'm the same boat. You know, I don't. Uh, I. You, the, your significant other is who you're. The human you're gonna potentially spend the rest of your life with. So you better think they're perfect. Jesus Christ! If you have anything you don't like about them, well, you're probably gonna end up in a bad situation. But people can't help that. Unfortunately. It's when you make fun of others, yeah. That that's the problem. Uh. Ugh. Uh. Wow, dude, the double. This is fucking brutal. Well, and yeah, obvious, uh, yeah, for, for the obvious things that I didn't say out loud, yeah, nobody's perfect, but forgot I have to break down every detail. Wow. I'll make it easy to understand. I hate smokers, okay? I don't actually. I hate smokers. And I'm allergic to cigarettes. I'm allergic to cigarette smoke. Then why the fuck would I go date the fucking... <laughs> God damn it. God damn. Like, let's say you're an eight-foot dude, all right? And and you have back problems, spinal problems. If you bend forward too much, you're going to break your spine for the rest of your life. You're not going to date a fucking four-foot chick. That's all I'm saying. And then on the other, to cover the other side of the conversation, doesn't matter what your preference is. Don't attack people if they don't meet it. Just stay silent and find someone else. Thank you, savior. many people try and make horrifically bad situations work for no reason? Wow. Five foot two going out with Lady Dimitrescu? Nice. I dated someone one inch taller than me before. One inch. And she never let it down. A single inch. I don't even know how tall. I'm either 5, 11, or 10. I don't know. Ah! Uh. Oh fuck! It's Doctor Kirk. What the hell? My brain isn't working. I'm gonna just put Doctor. Doctor dis. What if in the remake it's Doctor Disrespect, and he's even called that, and they even got him to play a play Kirk. Why don't I ever play the Animation series? 
you say to me after I streamed all three games in a row last year. Dr. Kirk? And Great. the fighting game. I've located game. the main generator Drew. of the third energy. Great. See if you can activate it. I'm sorry. I always have sassy responses to those questions because they're the most common thing ever and it just requires like a YouTube search. Yes. Do, 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 do. You don't ever do this, but I did it yesterday. What do you yeah. want from me? Error. Mm -hmm. Preparation procedure incomplete. Announcement. Power for generator is disconnected. Yeah, good. I hate that game. Do 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 do. Wow. Do 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 do. Nice. We're booting up the system. Generator test complete. Remember, a special key card is required to operate the generator. Uh-oh. <clears throat> Who's in here? Oh my god, have I ever been streaming for six hours? Can be a long one, fellas. Uh... Six hours flew by. That was shocking to look over. This is the longest game in the marathon, though, and the rest of them are pretty short, other than Silent Hill 2. That's gonna take me a while. Don't. Ah! Move. And what do you think you're doing? Carving a name for myself in history with the ultimate energy source. Ooh. Open your eyes, you freak. Your precious creation is nothing more than another weapon to be yeah, misused. Yeah, six five. <laughs> you seem to have a small degree of superficial intelligence. Oh no, I'm doing it's all these in one go. Just wasted on one who is about to die. Do -do -do. Our target has been secured. Rick, our target has been secured. Report here immediately. That is a bone. Sorry to interrupt your lecture, Doc. You were saying... Got him. Yes, I was saying. I discovered how the third energy could affect space if it ran unchecked three years ago. The bone I thought gun. that the energy had the ability to transfer selective space to an alternate time-space continuum. Look at this story. But I was incorrect. The space was not transferred. It was... Exchange. Nice dinosaur. To put it in terms that even you can understand, third energy has the ability to replace a pocket in space with one from a different time. What? Yes. I came to these conclusions following this evening's final experiment. You've seen the effects yourself. Those beasts were occupying the space this facility is located on almost 65 million years ago. Right. So that's how those dinosaurs appeared in our time. Precisely. And that is what I have done. Uh-huh. And how many people were sacrificed before you made this discovery? <laughs> Who cares? Her. The numbers are quite irrelevant. Let's just say that there were many... Irrelevant. Extraordinary deaths for ordinary men, don't you think? 
Spoken like a true devil. A god or a devil? Hmm. I don't care about that. Only my experiment. Enough. Third. Only one thing matters at this point. Your grand invention is blocking our escape. You need to destroy oh, the vortex. Load. <laughs> the only way to do that is to allow the generator's third energy levels to overload. Mr. Theoretically Zog. speaking, the third energy and the vortex will cancel each other out if they come in contact with one another. But there is one small catch. If you cannot stop the generator's third energy overload, this entire region may be shifted to another point in the space-time continuum. Then we'll just make God. sure to be somewhere else when the shift happens. No problem. But we couldn't even activate the device. <laughs> You're missing the initializer and stabilizer, right? I do Where love his they? voice acting. So funny. Calm down. They should be stored in one of the security level A rooms on floor B3. Very good, Doc. Now you understand our situation. We live, you live. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, roast beef. I didn't see any like mod thing. Maybe on Twitter side. Okay, I'm all set to whip up a program that will send a stream of third energy into the vortex. I'll keep an eye on the doctor. Regina, you go find those devices and overload okay. the third energy. Remember, they're in a security level A room on floor B3. Hold up. That whole floor is crawling with dinosaurs, including that T-Rex. Let's get this situation under control before charging off. Here, take this. The disc contains the draft plans oh, for the initial Oh, did you try and type the word gay? I, stumbled I may have actually banned that years ago and didn't unban it. the room where the parts are stored is not far from here. We should gather up the parts and assemble the devices. Don't be ridiculous. Regina doesn't have the technical knowledge for that. We don't even know if all the right parts are there. We'd be better off simply trying to hunt down the completed devices. It's too dangerous down there. She won't make it. It's your call then, Regina. You're mm. the one who has to do mm. this. So what's your choice? Yes, choice. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Whatever you no do, one's actually brought that up in a while. I forgot for that was a second. banned word. Not that I'm going to unban it or anything, but... Well... Uh, this way. Mm -hmm. oh! If I'm in caution, I'm actually going to... Like, lose. Yeah, to I was just fucking waiting for someone to actually say that seriously blind, but no one did. People actually understand how the internet is. Holy shit. But yeah, it's banned because 9,999 times out of a 10,000 in Twitch chat, someone saying the word gay is Meaning to offend. So, uh, and on the other side of the coin, why the hell do I care? Why would you even say that? Like, I'm, hey, Bach, I'm gay. Okay. I don't care. Bow. Got it. Do, 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 do. Most people think I'm gay as well, just simply because of my voice. Uh, so yeah, it's, we're getting the best of all worlds here. I had a lot of creepy gay dudes that used to hang out here often. And if you, and I'm not saying any, you know, actual like creepy. What? Dude. Wait, I'm doing something wrong. Oh, God damn it. I need off this elevator. 
This is so annoying. I am just getting fucked this run. Please, just give me good luck here. Please. Please, for the love of fucking God. I'm gonna have to kill myself on the way back. Shit! Run, Regina! Hey, Lutrum. Boop. We're going in. God, I hope this game gets remade one day. But I get that it's probably really, really hard to make a like RE2 remake style uh, horror game with dinosaurs. Because my biggest like concern with a dinosaur horror game is how do you balance it? Like raptors can't just like walk at you. They'd just be super, super dumb. And if they run at you, I mean, what the hell are you supposed to do? It would have to be, like, semi-action. I don't think making a horror game... Yeah, I don't know. It just seems impossible to balance. There I go. Don't worry, there's a reason I picked up uh, this medicine. Here we go. We'll be we'll be back in a sec. What? Jesus fucking Christ! The luck of this run. Oh my god, dude. We're completely fucked. We're completely fucked. I have to grab the grenade launcher now. Oh, I'm just gonna die again. Wait, wait. I did pick up something earlier. Can I use this? No, I don't have the plugs. Give me a plug. Any plugs? What's this? I don't even know where the healing items are because you need healing items like once a year. Like, I run this, like, probably 20 times a year. You never need to heal. Like, ever. Uh, there's no... There's... Wait, wait. Uh... I think this should make one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. And take that. Okay. Uh, I haven't done this in years. Uh, aid, recovery aid. Mix with... What, does this make a heal? Sure. Oh, sick. Okay. Oof. Yeah, the like I mean they might just make a first person run. I don't know.
I really hope they try and do a dinosaur. Well, I mean, they're get, we're getting Exo Primal, so a dinosaur game's years off at this point. This is actually sickening. Like, you, almost always, you just run by these guys. They don't even attack you. You just run right by. And the following me through every door is like, ugh. I think it looks awesome. Uh, I think we have to check this first. Maybe? Actually, now I don't think we do. Okay. Uh, yeah, there's a couple indie dino games that's coming out that look cool. The no AAA one. I mean, Arc 2 is the next AAA dinosaur game. <laughs> when is Arc 2 supposed to come out? Yeah, Compound Fracture looks awesome. I played Exoprimal. It is fun. But I don't think it's play this every day, all day for months kind of fun. Which is what they're going for. Exo Primal is going to be a horrible stream game. Uh, because the bitrate just can't handle it. It's like, it's too much. Every stream that... I look back at my Exo Primal stream, it's just pixels. Like, you can't see anything. It's unfortunate, but yeah, it's like objectively bad to stream. There's just too much shit on the screen at all times. Vampire Survivor somehow looks better than Exo Primal. Uh, well, it's it's only like really bad when there's a ton of like raptors and stuff on the screen, but that's pretty damn often. I hope Exoprimal's a good game though, but the beta wasn't a good sign. And like people, when I streamed Exoprimal, people were loving it for the first round and then just like, I think I played like five or six rounds and you know, by the freaking like sixth round there was like, 500, 600 viewer dip because <laughs> it's just like that's how much staying power the game is gonna have. It's just not good. Not good. And it's not even that it's not like oh I was getting MVP and stuff a lot. It's just yeah. It's no, I mean, at least Reverse has something to laugh at. Exoprimal is probably just going to be sad. Yeah, well, it's not fault of the games. It's sort of the fault of Twitch. They really, really need to upgrade this system soon. Desperately. Warning. Third energy is approaching critical points. Cease operation. Third energy output is approaching critical point. 
I wish they gave us like a road map or something on it, Failmore. Okay, Regina. Adjust the power output to maximum. Here goes. Just remember there's no turning back once it overloads. Then we won't look back. Crack that sucker and let's go out with a boom. The ceiling. Huh? The ceiling. Move it. <laughs> you fool. What was the point in saving me? How pathetic. Oh. Well, YouTube's audience is just a whole different thing. Like, people on YouTube enjoy way different games. Like, I think the biggest games over there are like Roblox, Minecraft. Uh, what else? Is it Among Us and Warzone? Gale. Okay. It's hard Let's to even good. check. Like, how do you Hurry. even check the, Take it easy, Gale. the streaming side? Take like, this. where's the browse page? Tag them with transmitter. Gale. Gale. You have to open YouTube gaming, right? I think I have that. All right, the overload levels Down. are increasing. Just a little more. Looking good. Gail, what happened to him? I don't know, but Kirk's gone. I'm gonna kill him! Yeah, the, the browsing for YouTube gaming is really bad. <laughs> Oh, golden. Thank you again, Red. This For is our it. music. All that's left is our escape. Let's go. Wait, what about Kirk? What about him? It's a miracle we're still alive at this point. Forget about him. Don't forget the mission. You're not here to babysit. Sorry, but I have a conscience. I'm taking you back now. No, you two get going. I'm going after Kirk. What? You're insane! Don't you remember our situation? The third energy can't be controlled anymore. Staying here any longer is suicide! I know. If I'm not back in 30 minutes, you two make your escape without do me. Do something! Hey, do something! Okay. Gail! That G.I. Joe deserved Thanks. it. That G.I. Joe deserved it. Come on. Thank you, Elephant Bones, for the seventy months. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's get out of here. We can't. At least not yet. 
It needs fuel and some repairs before it'll move. I'll take care of the fuel, then. It looks like this thing is powered by some type of nuclear energy. Here, put the fuel in this. Okay. Let's go. Bada -bum, bada -bada -bum. We're almost done, guys. We're almost done. Where the hell is it? Bada -bada -bum. No, there's no rando. It's hard to do like a fun rando for something like this because like there's no funny dialogue. Right. The cutscenes aren't skippable. Take this. There's like two different enemies in the game. Yeah, it's Dr. Kirk. What if the last boss was Dr. Kirk? Intruder detected at port. Lockdown in progress. Alright, if you mess up your movement here, you actually die, but, uh... We'll be fine. This isn't supposed to be no weapon, this part. You can shoot him with the grenade launcher. But, or you could just run. Oof. GG. Right, I'll be back really quick. Then we're doing RE2. Hey, fellas, RE2 remake.
blackmail. The final report of Operation Dr. Kirk. Agent name, Regina. Dr. Kirk. Status, unknown. Due to unforeseen elements of the area, we were unable to recapture Dr. Kirk. His survival is unknown. Gail. Status, alive. Gail did survive, but he is seriously injured and is currently recovering at our military medical facility. Rick. Status, alive. Rick is currently analyzing the data that was recovered from Ibis Island. Regina. Status, Alive. As for myself, I'm ready to begin my next assignment. Tom. Status. Deceased. Tom was attacked and killed by a giant reptile that was inhabiting the island. He will be missed. Cooper. Status. Unknown. We lost contact oh. with Cooper at the beginning of the mission and have not heard from him since Hey, then. Paisanos! Mission complete. Mission complete! Oops. Oops. Ah. Someone did a redemption. Which one was it? Guys, is it? Operation Instructions. Welcome to Raccoon City is God tier. You got mad skills. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you very much. When's the last time I played RE2 Remake? Holy shit, where is it? What? Where the hell is it, dude? December 4th. All right. Over a month ago. Resident Evil Poo. Uh, cost. Wait, wait. Last time we played with Noir. Actually, I think we played Claire last time. Injured Police. I'm using a 3080. Let's go, people. Thank you, Nami Toots. Thank you, Nami Toots. Thank you, Nami Toots. Two sides, every story. Two sides, every story. Two sides, every story. Two sides, two sides, two sides, do every story. Two sides, every story. Attention all citizens in chat. This is out of control. There are two sides every story. How many people left? Yo! Shit. It's everybody. They've all turned. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. The station. The station, guys, look. I 
Okay, good, good. Stay away. You bastard! No, I, there's, I didn't do anything during my break except eat like a grape. Here's what happened. I'm not playing a game that's like brain dead anymore. The speedrun for Dino Crisis is like the most boring speedrun ever. Do, 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 do. This one gives you brain stimulation. Wait, is it running at 60 FPS for you guys? Does it look good? Does it look good? Jesus. Open up! Hurry! Open up! Open this guy's door! Does it actually look 60? Okay, I'll trust you. Little stuttery. Is it actually stuttery? A bit. I'll keep an eye on it. Does anyone know what started this? Maybe it's one sec. It might be this. Oh, so, maybe this will fix it. That better? Oh my god, my controller! What's that? Don't worry, the timer stops. Unplug my controller because it was shaking. Oh! Yeah! Did you guys just see that? Looks good. Looks good. Hey, chat, how many sides to every story? No, not seven. No, not three. Oh my god, you guys. Fuck! Bad game. Sure. Oh god, what am I doing, dude? What am I fucking doing? I needed that bullet, you bastard. Well, I definitely needed those bullets. Oh my god, did he fall too? This is a disaster. Bye. Okay. Please don't be here, you piece of shit. Okay, he's not. Two sides to every Marvin. No, I tried. I tried. Uh, Marvin, I've got a situation here. I'm surrounded by zombies. Marvin, oh, you no, I'm me. not playing Wrath anymore. Marvin! Damn it. I haven't played Wrath since, like, the second week. Look! Hard old bar is cool though. Apparently the bingo line is still in, guys. It's still in. I read that too. Three bullets. I need Wait, is it this or Claire where you pick up these bullets here? 
God, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Going this way. Ah. I need to pick up some extra ammo. Somewhere. I think. I definitely do somewhere. Just don't know where. Come on, please don't. Oh god. Just, okay, leave me alone. You bastard. No, I need that later. Oh shit, I was supposed to abandon this. Standard. Dude! We'll just get this ammo. All good. There we go. I only quit because I couldn't play the first week. Like, that game came out right when a hurricane hit where I live, so... Um, I was like super behind. Forever. Stay. Stay. What's this fish scorpion jug? Or something. Fish scorpion jug, I think. Fish scorpion jug. Jug. Fish scorpion jug. Fish scorpion jug. Thank you, Marcel, for the 32. Fish scorpion jug. Alright, lady bow snake. Any lady bows in the chat or no? It's not that, it's that. Any lady bows? Any. Oh my god, please, dude. My skip button. Space. Ba -ba -ba -da -da. The graphics are looking spicy. Can you get a 4090 in Canada yet? Oh yeah, the movement in village is like... Like village over the shoulder, you mean? I'm... Yikes. Somebody's watching me. Somebody is watching me. Do they have it in stock? I don't know what, like, I don't know what to look out for for 49s. I do want to buy one, but there's all these different kinds. Hey. 
Every story you take. Every story you take will be two sided. Yeah, you like the emote? No reason to buy a 490. Yeah, I'll just play RE4 Remake at 4K on my 3080. Whoopsie Daisy! Hey! I'm not done talking to you! I will run like shit on a 3080. Maybe if I wasn't streaming it'd be work, but. Or 3080, sorry. Did I say 4080? Oh, really? Okay, I'll look into it. I, I've only, like, sort of browsed because I'm in no rush. I mean, maybe I should get one for Dead Space. I don't know. But that's in, like, two weeks. But I have... I have... I have enough money in my little piggy bank. I've been saving for a graphics card. Piggy bank. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. I know, Antelope. I was just thinking that. You know, I actually think my graphics card is sort of fucked. No joke. Um, I only say that because the, the game, the only game I play off stream is WoW. And it, you guys should see, it sometimes gets major graphical glitches and then it closes to desktop, like doesn't crash, it closes to desktop and then reopens and then freezes my entire computer. <laughs> I'm just like, and all the graphics are fucked. Like there's artifacting everywhere, it's brutal. Like it's, it's bad. So I'm sort of like a mini panicking. I should put back in the 6900 XT. Everyone made fun of my 6900X, like my AMD graphics card. But ever since I put in the 3080, I've been getting like just as many problems. What brand is it? Doesn't matter. Someone just said it doesn't matter. No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I think it's... I actually have no clue. I have not a inkling of a clue, actually. All right, guys, I might be getting wrecked at this part. Please don't make fun of me. Listen, I don't run this game much anymore, okay? Please don't. Uh, because the, the 6900... Because AMD fucking graphics drivers don't work with RE4 original, so I had to complete... And, and they don't work with RE1 either. Why aren't you moving, you bastard? I hate you. Fucking stupid piece of shit. No! Well, I'm so fucked, guys. I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. Now that stupid zombie's gonna get me on the way back. Thankfully, that's like the only precise dodge in the game. Oh my god, that was horrible. At least it was all back bites. It's fine. Yeah, it just adds a lot of pressure when you stream. So, um, if I streamed like Dead Space Remake, let's say, on 4K, like 144 FPS, oh. I wonder, would my 5950 bottleneck? Thank you, Zeh.
Well, wait, what is it? What even is the best AMD processor right now? Help! Wait, why isn't it much of a worry? Or while I'm streaming, I mean. Oh. Maybe I should have grabbed those. 7950X? Really? Jesus Christ! I know there's new strats for him, I just don't know what they are. Go, you! Woof! Yeah, yeah, yeah. CPU is everything for streaming, though. Well, I guess... Oh, no. I use NVENC now, so... Son of a bitch. Alright, this is where I got wrecked last run. Last time I ran this game, I got destroyed here. Oh, we have the extra inventory. That's okay. God, please let me run forward. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Please, 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 please don't bite me. Please don't bite me. I- I fuck you, you- you little shitbag. Where's Mr. X? Please don't. I'm taking this. Scuffed run. Scuffed run. I'm bad at this game. <sighs> the problem when I don't run any of these marathon games anymore, it's not that... Okay, let me toot my own horn for a second, and then I'm gonna shit down that horn. You ready? Alright. When I used to run marathon days, I would get, like, minutes for, or, like, seconds from my PB and a lot of games and seconds from record because those were two in the same. But now that I don't speedrun, like, hardly anything anymore besides marathon days, oh, it's so much harder to do good runs <laughs> of games you never play. Surprise, surprise. That was good. None of this run's going terribly. Thank you, Sonic, Zed, and Marcel. Thank you again for the resubs, guys. I can't fucking wait for RE4. Oh, I'm gonna play the balls off that game. Every day and night. 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 Why, why didn't they put this much effort into RE3? Because they knew it would sell as glorified DLC. We got fucked. Uh, am I gonna try, like, in this run? No. God, no. The, this, the, the record doesn't even use the shotgun anymore. I don't, re like, a lot of stuff... A lot of stuff in these games that you, you do in like a record attempt or a PB attempt save like two seconds, but they risk the whole run. It's really dumb. Hope I don't have to write a report on this. Like the the new G2 strat. I think I go forward here. You bastard dude! Please! That was my fault. You can actually manipulate him, but I just didn't do it. Wait, 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 wait. I'm so bad. You don't go this way as Leon. Oh my god, I'm so horrifically bad. Please, Mr. X, don't, don't, don't hurt me. Okay. Don't. Nah, 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 nah. Um. For games like that, like I have like 600, 700 hours in RE2 Remake, all it takes is one run. Like if I did a run directly after this, it would go 10 times better. It's just the the one run to shake off the D-Rust hurts. <laughs> you are an idiot. Open! Oh no, this guy's going to be not in a good place because I didn't shoot him. Where the hell even is he? 
Oh my god, why are you people in a John Leguizamo, you piece of shit? Go back to the menu. Yeah, the walls look really bad. I don't know. It's a setting I gotta change. I don't know what it is. Look at the doors. Watch. They have like black lines on them. Like my game actually looks really bad right now. That it... Like graphically there's an issue happening. I don't know exactly what it is. But it's not like too big a deal. Not many people could tell probably. Look at the door. See the black lines? What is that? Do I? Yeah, I'm just gonna check, just for fun. Because it doesn't hurt your timer. What are my graphics even on? 4K. Uh. Oh, minimum. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know uh, what this is. I think it's like 111. It's like 111312111. No, stop. Uh! God, God, I'm so bad. Same alarm as RE7. Oh! Give me a break. It's the RE7 boat alarm. Um, busy lady. Alright, I'm just gonna move this. This run's fucking terrible anyway. I'm just gonna move stuff. It actually, like, it actually hurts me. Sometimes marathon days hurt me, because it's like, it just makes me want to grind the game again. Because of how bad the marathon run is. <laughs> it's just like, I can do way better! It's so annoying. Stupid dress for marathons. Unfortunately, no. Ben didn't come through. Like, why the guy well, park his, exactly his tank for? here? More info on the people responsible for this mess. Roads out. Going through that gun shop. <sighs> you can stop right there. Start oh vanilla RE3? Uh I mean that's always on the table. Oops, that's not supposed to be there. I'm gonna be extra noob and grab these. Call me extra noob. Heard of the Umbrella Corporation? They're a pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. Does it? Oh yeah, the upgraded shotgun is poop compared to the original. Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Some things are better in the original. Gee, and some things are thanks. better in this game. Can't imagine a real scientist being down here. Come on. Sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? I don't think RE1, like RE2 Remake, is similar to RE1 Remake, where Jesus. it sort of just makes everything better. That earthquake? There are some things that I enjoy more in the first game. What the hell? Thank you, Mr. Bwomp. Yo, yo, yo! I like the ending much more in RE2 Original. RE2, oh, RE2 make knife, yeah. RE2's knife is Again. such dog shit. It's not too late to turn back, 
No chance. You're no chance, baby. Oh shit. Guys, a lot of you are probably new here and don't know this, but back when I used to run RE2 Remake, have you ever seen the movie Crawl? Holy shit! I was sponsored to speedrun RE2 Remake and shout out the movie Crawl at this section. And I did do that. All I had to do was get here and say, Crawl is in theaters, whatever, July 28th or whatever it was. Easy paycheck. It was actually a race between, I think it was me, Maxi, Carsey, and Dist, maybe? Chew on that, you overgrown son of a bi bitch. Overgrown son of a bitch. Leon, up here. <sighs> what the hell was? Just get up here. <sighs> One of the funniest clips from my channel is from that race. Because Can't say I didn't warn you. a movie company was hosting a Twitch race, all right? Into monsters, not reptiles. And my game crashed right after the gas station. And I was like, can we restart? <laughs> Just, they didn't say anything. And I was like, all right, well, guess I'm restarting my game from the beginning. And everyone has a like three minute head start, but sure. Okay. I still won, by the way. So let me get this straight. Umbrella sells monsters like that to who? Our, Our military? military? Somebody else's? They don't sell the monsters. They sell the viruses that make them. Freeze. And Annette is who makes the viruses. Scary as that alligator was, Annette is far more dangerous. Yeah, they ne the best part, they never gave me my tickets. You can run, Annette. I still haven't seen the movie <laughs> to this day. It's secret weapon. Oh, yeah. Because they were supposed to give everyone tickets. And um, that was the only non-American. Like, oh, we don't have Canadian tickets. Like, hey, billion dollar company, can you spare a fucking movie ticket? Like, Jesus Christ, it's part of the thing. Oversized son of an itch. I used to say that actually, so your joke is just as good as mine was. It never gets any laughs, don't worry, but just gotta say it a bunch. It is crazy though that they couldn't hook me up with a ticket, like. Are you fucking kidding me, dude? I know. But hey, that was the coolest sponsor I've ever done. That was awesome. Always been good at running. Thank you, Shawnee. Bravo. Gonna burn in your life, huh? You'll never get your filthy hands on the G. On the G. I'm not the only one after it. You realize that? And you won't die alone. What? 
Oops. Oh my god. Thank you, Tapples. You can stop right there. God damn! I can't wait to see more from Murray 4. Let Ada say another sentence, please. Still blows my mind how they replaced the voice actress. Like, that's crazy to me. I think she did one of the best jobs in this game. Oops. Ada? <clears throat> Where are you? Yeah, the, back with the scam crew, people thought the October 1st thing was like, oh, that's when they're going to announce RE3 Remake. That's a pleasant smell. Kind of replaces voices a lot, to be fair. Is that true? Beyond RE1, obviously. Guess so. Yeah, she did an awesome job. The voice acting union thing is something I don't understand. I haven't done research on it, but like, it's so weird to me seeing like, there's so much discourse between voice acting and, and stuff. Um, like I said, I don't know much about it, so. I don't like to preach or rant about stuff I don't know. Like 99% sure on. Uh, but yeah. It's, it's strange to me. I f I'm probably dead wrong in this, but I feel like whatever is going on with like the voice act the voice actors guild and stuff. Am I wrong to think that the laws surrounding that career path are archaic? Because it sure seems that way. Cable car. Interesting. I wanted to be a voice actor when I was younger, she go? and where the city I was living in taught voice acting lessons, and the teacher was, uh, Coming, was, um, uh, Matthew Lillard, Shaggy from Scooby-Doo, and also, uh, the killer in Scream. Talk about movie with great casting. Oh my god, the Scooby-Doo movie. They fucking nailed the casting for that. Don't turn towards me. And he did. And he did! I couldn't see. The shadows were up to high graphics. It got me bit. <laughs> Please, dude. <laughs> That's what people want from video game movies, though. Like, give us th give us that kind of casting. For, like, an RE movie. Chris Pratt was a strange choice, I mean. The saddest part about uh, the Netflix Resident Evil show, the saddest part is the thing that got most criticized, Wesker being black and being played by uh, 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 Lance Riddick. Or was the best part of the fucking show. Now that is... Yikes. DON'T! Bastard.
I actually didn't hate the show, but um, it's it was a very bad show. But I didn't like. I wasn't like shaking with anger at it. There were some cool parts. More than you can say about most of the RE shit. Yeah, he was actually great. I loved him as Wesker. When he showed up in the in the full suit, I was like, I thought that was sick. I watched that scene so many times. Oh my god. This is getting worse. This is not the right way to go around. Oh my god, I'm so lucky. I'm not lucky. Oh god, he won't do it. He won't grab. Grab, you bastard. This is sickening. This was so unfortunate, dude. I can't. Oh, okay. Yeah, the other guy grabbed instead. God damn, that was annoying. That part usually goes well. It's just with with Claire you go inwards, with Leon you go outwards, and I always get them confused. And it fucked me. at it, buddy. No. What's your guys' favorite game to watch on the speedrun marathon list? The hell was that? Thank you, Sidicus. On this list. All right, people. Oh, good, good, good. Oh my god. Dude! Playing this just makes me want RE4 so much more. Ah, I can't wait. Yeah, I, I love this one too. This was... This game is something special because, um... It was like the first... Other than... Forget if this is queen or king. Whatever. I'm just shoving the queen in there. Wow. I am bad. Very bad. I lost my train of thought. Last okay. of Us was awesome. Almost there, Ada. That's how you do a fucking video game adaptation. The only thing I'm iffy on is the actress they chose for Ellie, just because it's like it's so far from. But um, she's doing a good job acting, so whatever. It just looks like, not only does it not look like her, it looks like polar opposite. Um, but, uh, yeah, the show is fucking awesome. I think that that first episode was very, very well done.
I got you. I hope he's dead. Let's hope that's the last of them. Well, that was like 140. Cable car will take us down to Nest. My wristbands are ticket to ride. Nice. Where'd you get that? Borrowed it. Anyway. Um, what the hell am I doing? Uh. Oi! I don't know what the. F Why do I have two fucking heels? I'm not gonna do. I reviewed it earlier in my stream, but um, yeah, I just thought they, if, like, the first ep if we're talking just the first episode, I think it's one of the best video game adaptations ever, or mo like movie or TV or live action. Uh, but yeah, the intro, like the way they introduced the virus and and how they played out how it happened, was really, really, really cool. I, I loved it. This tram is bound for Nest. And I hardly even wanted to watch it, by the way. I wasn't someone that was like crazy pumped for the show or anything. I'm like, ah, I guess I'll watch the first episode. People seem to like it, so. Uh, but yeah, it was sick. You don't need to play Last of Us to enjoy the show, by the way. And that's that's the best part. Like, if you've never played Last of Us, give the show a try. Yeah, Uncharted. Woo -hoo. Where am I going? This way. Yo, Raboot. Yeah, Last of Us Part 2 is... Ouch. Oh my god, that's not where you're supposed to shoot. Uh-oh. That zombie is just going to be camping, I think. You know what? Pedro Pascal wasn't sold on him right away. Great actor. Wasn't sold on him right away for Joel, but... By the end of the first show episode, I was like, this is sick. I have too many knives. You coming? He's... Oh, I think he passed this way. Oh, you don't. Oh, you bastard. Get away from me. <laughs> yeah, he was amazing in Game of Thrones. Dr. Lee, your presence okay. is urgently requested. Chief Cartwright in the East area. Yeah, he's great as Mandalorian too. He's just a great actor. Actor. And now after Joel, like I'm sure by the end of Last of Us, gonna be like, hell yeah, dude. Oh, Joel. We put shadows back on low. I can't believe it's almost 7 a.m. What a stream time. Oh shit, what are these numbers? I don't remember. I think it's this one. 2067 maybe? Oh sh fuck. Thank God, thank God, thank God. You know what other show I wasn't excited for at all and almost didn't watch, but it was fucking awesome is uh House of the Dragon.
Uh, they might fried Hylian. They might. Let's see. Why are you here already? Is that Mr. Roxor? Oh yeah. I I woke up at like freaking 10 p.m. I totally forget how to do this part. And it's the hardest part in the run. Oops. Yeah, same. I was sort of done with it too. I mean, a lot of people were. Yeah, hopefully. I'm really hoping that Dead Space is a good speed game. Because it comes out in a couple days. Or next week, right? to do here. I don't know what to do. I actually don't know what to do. I just can't remember. That's a problem. Uh, what button do I have it bound to? Oof. I couldn't remember. It's bound to Q. Oh god, oh god, oh god. This guy's gonna eat my ass for breakfast, isn't he? Isn't he? Isn't he? Oof. Wait, I don't have another flash. Welcome back. Why did I throw that one of the fucking you stairs? Five new messages. Ugh. Who left the freezer open? Guys, I'm going to. Ari exploding for dude Ari one has such a funny uh there's something that people think is there and isn't which is one scary zombie mode this I'm gonna get destroyed here Thank you, Garrett. No! <laughs> okay. Just that did the trick. You have dispersed. A dangerous solution without authorization. Your actions have been logged. And you may be subject to disciplinary measures. Evil Cherry. My neighbor, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's hard to predict what RE games are going to come out after 4. Like 9 for sure, but after that, I don't know. Hopefully the G is up here. I'm going to assume something with Lair and Jill.
I don't want that. I don't have enough grenades. I'm stupid, and this sucks. I don't know how I don't have enough. Oh, because this. Oops. The stupid G adult. Damn it. I should have. There's an extra grenade I could have grabbed. I just didn't. I thought I had enough. Well, yikes. Bring back Ark, a friend of Liana S. Kennedy. True. Even though Leon is the most popular, I feel like Jill is the face of the game. Right. Still, I'm for some reason. Just because she's in so many other things. Or Jill and Chris. Yikes, please do your hand slap thing. Not that. Not that. Not no, no. Please do your please do your hand th do that hand thing, dude. Do that hand thing. Yeah, that thing. No no, pl please don't punish me for being bad. Thanks. Uh oops. Uh. No! How am I doing this wrong? He should be dead, right? Die! Uh oh. Bella? Sir? Ugh! He's dead, right? Whew. Oh, for some reason my FPS doesn't go very high in this room. Target has been neutralized. Ending quarantine. It does, yeah. The, the, the knife still does the same damage, it's just it deteriorates. Like, the damage is tied to the, um... The durability. And durability goes down faster when FPS is up, so. Or just take that how you will, you know. You know. Leon's so shiny. The only thing I think is a bit much with these graphics is everything is like... Like, sometimes the game looks insanely realistic, and then other times it looks like you can just got unpackaged from, like, a Barbie toy. There's something else wrong with my graphics. His eyebrows are like a, looking at a static screen. My mouse is not working. Okay. Nah, nah, nah. I'm not. I want to hear the song longer. That's my excuse. Yeah, the knife sucks ass in RE3 though. Oh, whatever. I'm, this is already a noob enough run. Excuse me. Yeah, I love this song. This is one of my favorite songs in the whole freaking whole franchise, bro. Joke. 
Please RE4 remake be this good. Please. Please. Is that too much to ask? Oh, reverse only has only has the hunk song. Why, oh, why did I do that? I knew that was coming. I don't know why I did that. Why did I do that? I got hit! And he got hit. I'm bad as hell. Please, please just stun. No more danger shit. Why, why? I think he took three things of damage, I think. Why does he keep going to the rock? The OG RE2 fight, the OG RE2, uh, Mr. X fight's pretty fucking, like, bullshit. It's really hard to dodge him. I looked away for a sec. Was there like squares and pixels in that explosion? My graphics card actually on the brink of death. Maybe I'm crazy. Actually, I just want to. I'm trying to see stuff I want to see. Can't believe he actually misses her. Can't believe I actually miss her. Same, dude. Can't believe it. Leon? Hey. Hey. We nice, made it. nice ending. Just like I said we would. Hey. I hate that. I hate that ending so much. Like, that that just feels like insanely rushed. After that epic escape, I wish they followed it up with an epic ending. And the B scenario is no better, in my opinion. I I really dislike the endings in this game. The RE2 original had such good endings, man. This one, woof. G Jizzle! Is Alien Isolation a good speed game? Oh yeah, it's great. Hey.
Oops, no. <sighs> what does everyone think of the game on the screen? <laughs> Alright, one sec. It's very fitting that you can see this game from RE2's menu, seeing that it's just glorified DLC for the game. Alright. Time for a, a an amazing run. Haven't played it since November. Damn. November 15th, last played. Holy shit, it feels like I just played it yesterday. The fuck? <laughs> it's from for some alien. I can't believe how much content I've squeezed out of this fucking game. I only ran this like dead seriously for three days, I think. And ever since that, those three days, like in 2016 or something, uh, it's just been for marathon day. Not yet, not yet. All right, play game, alien, nightmare mode. Uh, yes, are you sure I pick nightmare mode? It's pretty hard. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, glitchless, yeah. Glitchless. Yeah, one of my favorite runs is glitchless alien isolation. Who loves Alien in the chat? Let's talk about some Alien stuff, guys. What's everyone's favorite Alien movie that isn't one or two? You can include Predator. Or, no. Alien vs. Predator, I mean. And per you can include Prometheus and, and Alien Covenant. Alien vs. Predator movie needs a remake. Who's with me? Alien vs. Predator 2 sucks ass. Did you wake up early? Well, that movie as much sleep as the rest of you. I maybe I need to rewatch it, but I kept falling asleep, and then when I actually finished it, I was like, "Damn!" I realize it's a very similar model to the Nostromo. Yes, M class. No, Danny DeVito as Predator. Close inspect. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. Haven't seen her. I'll go check on her. I'm swinging my hands. What the hell's going on? Taylor, good morning. Ripley, it's certainly not good. I just look at the ground to help me do lines better. And do you need to? Sorry. You need to like position yourself like, like one dead. footstep away from leaving the room. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. All right. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. I hope this actually works. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. Yeah, I know. This should be good. I I, I always do the intro badly because I just forget how to manipulate it. I still haven't played the DLC. Samuels 
He's probably been up for hours. All personnel to the bridge. That's us. Looks like we're up. I hope RE4 remake is long. Who the hell are you? Huh? I want another good alien game. You don't even have a name you tag. Had a restful journey. The Torrens is in very good order. Hey asshole. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? <laughs> Hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how we doing? SMG loaded and calibrated. Prep vector lock. Prep com so I can say hello. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? Mm -hmm. You can watch the approach on the monitors. Yeah, I went hard on Aliens Fire Team when it first came out. I was grinding that shit very, very, very hard. But it just wasn't uh, it wasn't a big it wasn't a big success on Twitch, so I stopped pretty quickly. I want a game. Would I want a similar game to this one? I want this game, except aliens it. You know how Alien is, the first Alien movie, and you know how Aliens is. Do that. Give me Alien Isolation, but there's many aliens, and you can kill them. So keep the stealth aspect in, and just up the action. That's what I want. I think that'd make the ultimate alien game. Keep graphics just like this. Bring in a ton of different alien- There's like hundreds of different alien species in the alien franchise. Bring them all fucking in here. Bring the water ones in. Bring the red ones in. Bring the blue ones in. Bring in the queen for a boss fight. Give me everything. Fucking bring in that weird looking dude from Alien Resurrection for the love of God. Al well, Colonial Marines, but not fucking trash and less action. Plenty of Marines isn't, like, what I'm talking about. I more so mean this, like, claustrophobic areas with aliens coming from every direction. I'm more so talking about, like, Alien Trilogy for the PS1, if you've ever played that. That's more aligned with what I'm talking about. I like that game too, but holy shit, it's hard. Doing a big ol' save. Oops, what the hell am I doing? Doesn't anything here work? Don't look, guys. Don't look. So this is my glitchless alien playthrough. This door should- okay, the door- you need to hug the door a little for it to open. UGH! Wait, one in the chat if this is your first time watching me run Alien. <laughs> Epic, dude.
we're in. Glitchless. <laughs> glitchless, suck a S. Yeah, this is glitchless, except some weird stuff has happened so far. Uh, the Xenomorph does exist. Yeah, you'll see him. He'll kill me like 50 times, don't worry. Oh, who's been watching Velma? Anyone in chat? How's that? I hear it's... I hear it's pretty funny. Velma enjoyers. From what I hear, I don't think being like woke is the problem. I think the show just like sucks in every way it can. Yeah, I hear that it's just everything's bad. Station serving seeks and communication technologies, tech support services, and Gemini Exoplanet Solutions. Velma. But guys, they're trying to be I feel like they're just trying to be uh Wednesday, except it's fucking terrible. Like I said, I haven't I haven't watched it, but I did watch some clips and I've seen everyone's reaction on the internet and it seemed uh too bad. Season two already confirmed for Velma, really? Or for Wednesday? Crazy. Crazy. Dude, I can't wait for Arcane Season 2. Now that's a good fucking show. I shouldn't have quit. Yeah, Wednesday was great. Station serving the Solomon's Gallery of all Have I watched Tekken Bloodlines? No. Your wife is woke and says Velma's too. Uh, what the hell am I even doing? Be sync. Yeah, it's a shake weight. I'm waiting to use it uh, later on when I have some spare time. I'm gonna put the shake weight in me. No, no, you just can just phase through walls naturally. So how you go through walls is you just, you... I think what, in between 130 FPS and 160 is the sweet spot. Uh, but just spam the... You literally just spam the crouch button. 
No, I've never seen a huge spider in my life. So I have crouch bound to my mouse wheel. And I go, yeah ha Wait, I'm stuck. Wait, what the? Wait, something weird happened. Oh, I know what happened. My mouse is fucking broken. Yeah. So some people get away. If we see it, we just run. Hey buddies. Ow. 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 Holy fuck. They were not in favorable locations. Ow. Jesus dudes. Come on. Fuck it died. Oh no! Oh no! I'm fucked. I... I just realized... Because that door... Because my mouse bugged out, I think there's gonna be enemies over here and they're gonna kill me. Yeah. Thank you, Flintstone. God, I hope there's no one over here. Oh, shit. Yeah, shit. Ah, oh, good. There's no one here. Okay. All right, so this is the hardest glitch in the run. Not this one. The next one. Well, this one's pretty annoying, too, sometimes. Uh-oh. Alright, fellas, so if we do this correctly. Uh oh. And we just skipped 90% of the game. Blair. Radio contact. I'm okay. here. Where's the uh, he's coming? Thank God, I hear you. I need you to extend the dog cradle flip quickly. There are two. Should be close by. No, the alien's coming. No, he's actually in the run. I'll die to him like a million times. Watch. the part in the game when you figure out there's more than one alien. Well, it's way later, actually. The docking clamps are engaging. Do I agree that you can have a favorite game without playing it? Uh, yeah. I mean, sometimes, like, if you played a game, like, 30 years ago, let's say, and you right now say it's your favorite game, like, some people are so... Just, like... If you went back and you played it again, you might feel the polar opposite. 
so yeah, I think no that's fine. It's long gone. Wait, I think I can use the maintenance. And some instead. games are very similar to movies nowadays, is, like like Last of Us is a good example of freaking Metal Gear Solid 4. Alright guys, well I'm probably gonna die a few times here and I apologize. One try. I haven't done that in a single try in actual years. It's been years. Uh... No, probably not dinosaur. I'm now realizing how many of people in chat care so little about this run that no one said anything to me getting that in one try because I've spent upwards of 30 minutes on that exact part many times in marathon days. And I just beat it in like 40 seconds. Oh, no need. There's nobody apologizing for. I'm just. I'm just saying, like, yeah. No surprise. Um. All right, who's ready for some RNG? Rip. Oh, it is part of the run. It's just normally I spend like 30 minutes dying there to the alien probably 50 times over. And saying I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. This I never do this part right. But this time, one try. No, no. Uh oh. I hope that still works. Uh, if you just throw a flare there, they don't go for you for some reason. Alright, now we need shotgun ammo, which is super rare. I think that's revolver. Um... Yeah, the drops are RNG. Jesus. No ammo. I haven't. I've only actually played this game one time. Like, casually. It's too long. To justify a second playthrough. <sighs> yeah, basically jokes. Nah. I don't think. <laughs> Ammo? Alright, big RNG- wait, wait. Oh, big- wait, wait. Sorry, I'm like brain dead. Um, 
Big RNG time. Uh, oh, I mean, just think of some of your favorite games. Look up the world record or the speedrun. See if you're into the speedrun. A lot of, just because a game is good doesn't mean the speedrun is good. Especially if you're going for like an optimal run. Like most games are awful to play at a, at a high competitive level. The spread on this shotgun's horrible. Like, for example, you might think, like, oh, I love Earthbound. I'll run Earthbound. Well, I hope you like counting every single step you take. Stuff like that. Like, name some games. I can tell you if they're good speedruns. In my opinion. Super Monkey Balls, amazing speedrun. Yeah, I consider RE3 an awesome run. Surprise, surprise. A muck runner. Oh yeah. Yeah, Dark Souls, good. I'll respond to the bad ones. Save for the night seems annoying to run. Rule of Rose, that would be boring as hell. Dude, the RNG! Come on. He won't then doesn't seem very fun. I could be wrong about that. Dark and Daxter seems fun. There's a lot of hard glitches in that, aren't there? Oh my god, that one trick in Wind Waker where you have to die and then land on the ferry seems nuts. I don't even know if they still do that. Yeah, RE4 is a good run. RE4 is actually a great speed run. It's just really, really hard. Got it. Uh, RE8? Um, yeah, RE8's an awesome run. The intro can get a little annoying, but... I like Village. Dead Space 2 is super glitch heavy, I think. What do you need me to do? Get up here, Monster Hunter? I think Monster Hunter is mostly like individual level, like speed running a certain monster with a certain weapon. But Monster Hunter is also like, with that individual level speed runs, like they are not, they might not be what you expect. Like most monsters, even the hardest ones in the game die in like a minute or less. Pretty sure in Monster Hunter what you hope for in like the main game runs is just every time you hunt a monster you're like please give me the RNG. <laughs> yeah I beat um I have like a hundred and some hours in Monster Hunter World and a hundred and some hours in Monster Hunter Rise. Hey, no 
problem, Jerba. Thank you for the four months. I wish I got into Monster Hunter earlier in my life, but... Oh, nice. Ryosh. The thing I don't like about Monster Hunter is that it's mainly an online game and it's like insanely easy to cheat. I hate it. I hate that aspect. Like, there's no anti-cheat at all, which makes me sad, but it's fine. It's like, I think of Monster Hunter as something like it's cool to achieve these things and get this cool armor, but it sort of makes me a little sad that you can just boot up Cheat Engine, press unlock all, and then you just have every single solitary thing in the game and can still I'm play online. I see them. But it's not, it's whatever. Yeah, you go to the bathroom and alien isolation's over. <laughs> yeah, I, I love Monster Hunter as well. It's just, the the thing that the besides the cheating, the thing that I find hard to cope with in Monster Hunter is I, I like to take those kinds of games pretty serious, like the high skill level ones. But it actually takes a lot of time. Now, save the speeches. This is true. Getting really fucking good at any weapon in that game takes hundreds of hours. Because to get good at a weapon, you need to also know every single ability that every single monster can do. And then, with what abilities are good to counter those. People think of Monster Hunter as just spam your weapons game, but it's- it's- if you want to be good, it's the polar opposite. That game's hard as fuck to be really good at. Because you just need to memorize every single thing. It's like learning a boss in Village of Shadows, like Resident Evil Village, Village of Shadows difficulty, and but there's like 40 of them, you know? So I'm always in this like, I'm like having fun, but at the same time I hate myself because I'm like, ah, I just, I'm not good enough at the game to have the most fun I can. And getting good at the game requires like playing in practice mode and, and I, that's boring. It's just like, ah. This part looks so- I love this part. The graphics are so cool. I love seeing the aliens up here. Oh shit! Berlaine, I'm on my way up to the bridge. Um, it definitely takes some good practice, solid fat. Probably put like 10 hours of practice or way more into that. I did, yeah, we watched it at the start of the stream. GG, fellas. Berlaine? Yeah, I use gun lance and hammer. And I was starting to get really good at gun lance and I was really enjoying myself, but I just got bored of the game because I was I was at the point where I was grinding like those uh those levels to fight the infected monsters. I forget what it's called. Oh yeah, yeah, that ending. Poggers. A very poggerific ending. Oh, sequel bait. Where has that sequel coming along? Why does Velma get a season two, but Alien Isolation doesn't get a, a sequel? <laughs> this is 
differently. This is Soupy. Signing off. Alt F4. All right, next up is a little game I like to call Bok Tower. No, so at the start of the stream, I did viewer choice. I let you guys... Wait, where the hell's my controller? Oh, I unplugged it. Um, I let chat decide on the kind of marathon we were going to do, so I had, like, a bunch of different choices, and chat just picked their favorite one. Which was a horror speedrun marathon! Come on, hurry it up! Slowest title drop ever, dude. I think I have to reboot the game. Controller's not. Well. Wait, is it still not working? One sec. What? I'm on. Wait, it says I, I. Oh no, did I not press save? No, my controller should work. Bruh. Why won't it work? One second. Wait, didn't we have this problem the other day? And I don't even remember how I fixed it. Yeah, once I start clock time. Or once I. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there we go. Ah! Ah! Who's loving Clock Tower so far? Poggers! Now I'm trying to fix my schedule. I've been streaming for eight hours already. People, people. I need to go. What the hell's the action button? Why? All right, RNG time. Empty, great. Bad RNG. Reset. Do, 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 do. Silent Hill 2 is up next, guys. That is a poggers. Is this the best horror game on SNES? Name, uh, name another actual horror game on SNES. Don't say fucking Doom or any of that shit. Name another SNES horror game. You can name any, as long as horror is the first genre. Any. Go for it. I'm ready. Anyone? That's not for Super Nintendo. Yeah. So, is this my favorite horror game in SNES? Yep, because it's literally the only one. Is 
Zombies ate my neighbors, guys. Are you calling that a horror game? Why do people say zombies ate my neighbors? And that every time we have this conversation, people say zombies ate my neighbors. It blows my mind. That game is so stupid. Like you play as a fucking kid with spiky blonde hair and sunglasses that shoots like a squirt gun. Like, oh yeah, ooh. Terrifying. I don't know what my back button is. Dude! I better not die here. I don't know what button to press, though. Okay, please let this be the right button. He's dead. I'm dead. Why is it not the action button? Okay, don't worry, we start right where we died. Okay. Okay, I guess I'll try the other two buttons. Bum, 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 bum. The fa the best clock tower game? Uh, my favorite's three. I mean This one's this one's pretty good. Uh Clock Tower one is is it's a classic. Two is horrifically bad and three is really fun. Oh wait, I need to check this one more time. Yeah, that's because this game is based on a movie, basically. The movie's called Phenomena, or Creepers, but it's starring Jennifer Connelly. Like, go watch the movie. You'll... you'll see. Also, the, like, okay, the movie's directed by Dario Argento, the, who also made Suspiria. The first kill in Suspiria is a girl coming through stained glass rooftop, and that's the first kill in this, too. I mean... Yeah, I used to love the movie before I even made like the connection that it was Clock Tower. Um, yeah, I loved it. It's a bit boring, but um, I really like the music and um, yeah, it's worth a watch. I think I'm not going to say you're going to love it because you, you might you probably won't, but um, I do enjoy it. Looks like a bird's nest. Yeah, I seen Malignant. Pretty cool. Uh, I haven't beaten Dread out. I just got bored and stopped playing. I watched the entirety of Cabinets of Curiosity, or Cabinet of Curiosities, last week. It was really good. Ah, uh, it's like 20 minutes or something. Ish. Go, girl, go! Yeah, the menu was really good. It's about a fine dining experience. That's it. It's amazing. 
Trust me. Nah, okay. The menu is... It's about a fine dining experience, but it's basically a horror movie. Which is on Disney Plus for some reason. It shocks me that that movie's on Disney Plus. Like, hello? A ham was put in here. So I only... Oh wait, no, never mind. Foolish. Oh, is The Walking Dead on there? Hmm. Thank God, okay. I'm gonna go for whatever ending it gives me this time. Uh... Have I seen Sweet Home? You mean the, like, Asian horror show on Netflix? Or Korean, I can't remember. If you're talking about that, then no, I haven't seen it. Go, girl, go! This is a speed run. Move your ass. Yeah, Clock Tower making a comeback would be cool. It could definitely work. I mean, look at all the Steam, the random games on Steam that are just run around and hide from something. Night Cry is... Ugh! That game is... I hated that game. Uh, yeah, there, like, the only clock tower I really, really like is three. And I, I, well, actually, so I thought the first game was, like, like, clock tower for PS1. I just, um, I, I kept trying to play it, but I was just got really bored. Anyways, I actually trucked through it a few years ago, and it's, it was awesome. I really, really liked it. Clock Tower 2, on the other hand. Oh god, that game is terrible. I think Clock Tower 2 might be in the bottom, like, three games I've ever played. Wait, is this the room? Possibly? Oh! I've never seen this room on the top floor, ever. I don't think. Both Clock Tower 2? Maybe not. I played the PS1 version. People, 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 people. Scariest game. The, the RNG here is actually fucking nuts. Like what? Oh, 
Wait, what the heck is the button? I guess it's B. No, no, no. No, don't press that. Leave. Scariest game and scariest movie. I have no clue. It's super subjective. I guess we just go downstairs now. What does everyone think is the scariest game and movie? Let's hear it. No. Death Raven. The big winners. So far. Yeah, I, you know, I honestly think probably Dead Space for me for game. Because it's all jump scares, and unlike every other game, you actually have to fight the jump scares. They have to get fucking jump scared and immediately react or you're dead. Yeah, Visage was actually really scary. I agree. Yo, Prod. Barbie supermodel on the Sega Genesis. Yeah, for a movie though, that's really hard. I like when I was a kid. Probably Dawn of the Dead remake in theaters scare me. Day of the Dead scared the falls off me. Oh, actually, no. When I was a kid, the scare that I thought the scariest franchise was Chucky. I hated that shit. I remember watching Evil Dead 1 for the first time in my bed when I was like, oh god, probably like eight years old or something. And then, uh, right after, there was a... There was a freaking So I was all- I was always scared of dolls when I was young. And... Dude, let me- go. I was always scared of dolls. And so I watched Evil Dead 1. Terrifying movie when that came out. Evil Dead 1's like fucking horrific for a child to watch. And then... And then right after there was a there was a trailer. It's like, oh, Chucky will be on next. And I just couldn't even get out of bed. I was fuck. I had to pee so bad. I just couldn't even. Oh my god, I was terrified to even walk on the floor. Just like scared shitless. Mr. YouTube. The switch is in the clock tower. That emote goes really well with the atmosphere in the background. SNES 9X.
Scariest thing I watched recently? I have no clue, dude. I haven't been scared from a movie in a long time. I hope I don't die in the elevator, because that is one of the endings I may get. That's okay, though. Are we gonna get it? Somewhere. Oh, we live! Uh, what floor do I want to die on? I guess three. Beat it, GG, that's one of the endings. It is actually one of the endings, that isn't a death. That's an ending. Nah, true ending's actually pretty shitty. I usually get ending G, that's my favorite one. I think it's G, where you climb up the clock tower and you kick her off. That's the best one in my opinion. How does that happen? Uh, I forget the specifics. But every ending requires you to do specific things. There's like eight endings in the game or something. Yeah, I should have did car ending. You think this is fast? There's literally a- there's a two minute ending. Who's ready for some Silent Hill 2? I'm gonna need some help with Silent Hill 2 though, because I don't even remember how to run it. do this. Comics. Alright, I'm booting it up. Here we go. Sorry to just close the game like that, but we got shit to do. We got shit to do. Uh, Silent Hill 2. Please work. Forget what I double pressed it. No, 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 no. Wait. No. Yes. Game?
Okay, one sec. I'm gonna reboot the game. I'm scared. Uh, I... I seen Windows Defender, uh, killed one of the files when I booted it up. But it's still booted for some reason. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. I just wanna give that back. Wait. No. Oh wait, it blocked a website from coming up. What? Oh, I guess when you boot up the game, it takes you to the Enhanced Edition website. Oh, I guess it does. Whatever. I hope that controller works. I, I don't really know. Wait, why can't you guys see the game? No, no, no. Why doesn't the game show up for you guys anymore? Try this. Work? Um, guys. No. Can't you guys see? Trying to alt tab and it's fucking my butt here. Oh Jesus! What? Game. You see it? That's baloney. What? It actually? Oh my God! Wait, my OBS. Is fucked. I can't even use it. Hello? You guys hear me? I can't. Wait. I can't click on, on anything. This is garbage. It actually won't even let me alt tab. Okay. Wait. Work. Oh man, this game is so weird. Uh. So like anything I click on outside of the game doesn't let me like it's overriding every click. So strange. Guess I'll exit. Oops. Sorry guys, this is stupid. I know. I'm sorry. It just won't let me. All right, so this should work, I hope. <sighs> um, I only know easy guys. Oh my God, I did not mean to be the Wait. Uh, what is my save button? Oh, is it this? Oh my god, is it this? Please. Oh no. Whatever. We'll just roll with it. It works. My save button is clicking in on the thing. That's fine, I guess. You have to constantly save in this game. Uh, because, uh, it makes you, your stamina refresh. Alright, we're nailing it. Here we go. This is gonna take a bit, though. Like, oh. Well, we'll see. I did put it on easy, so hopefully it'll be faster than 
Last time I played, I played on normal and it just like fucked everything over. Yeah, when you beat this, you have like thousands of saves at the end of this game. Oh yeah, so in Silent Hill 3, apparently you spam a button like the whole time you run the game. Silent Hill Remake, everyone! Lost? Pump up the jam. I know, I love that song, Forest. Really good. Or music. Music. That bread cord. Look at everyone pouring in for Silent Hill 2. They love it! Never seen a chat love a game so much. I'm getting the chainsaw. No one can stop me. Run. It gives you... it refreshes your stamina when you save. Whatever ending it gives me. The speedrun... I don't think the speedrun always has the same ending, I guess. I forget. Guys, you think those footsteps are gonna be in the remake? As paid DLC. Bruh! I'm not gonna do the game load strats. I'm just doing game save. Because I don't want to soft lock myself or some shit. Uh, so I'm playing something called the Silent Hill 2 Enhanced Edition. So it's a fan-made, like, HD version of Silent Hill 2. It's pogrific, if I may. May I? Oh, dual sense to stick your hand in the toilet. Yeah! No, the HD collection's fucking horrible. It's not the H no. The HD collection's an official game they released that you purchase. It's horrifically bad. Like one of the worst HD versions of any game ever. It's notoriously bad. It sounds like shit. Looks like shit. Smells like shit. Outbreak remake, game dog. Yeah, look at this one. Alright, let me add her. Is, is it dead? dead? I just scooped him. Who's the voice actor for James? Did they say yet? Yo, silly Annie. Alright, where the hell do I go? I always get lost in this first intro section. I think you just go right. 
And then you just go up the alley and that's it? Yoinkers! Helpers! No, that's not it. I think you just go straight actually then. I know it's simple, I just can't remember. Please let this be the way. Pretty sure this is... Squeak, squeak. Any squeakers in the chat? Oh, by the way, everyone. New e relatively new emote, Bach Grump for followers. If any followers want a free emote, Bach Grump. It works in other channels too. And for any seven TV users, Bocking. Yeah, I don't know. I know, I know, Aaron. I know. Hey, I only run this game purely for you guys. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, all right? I need is this oh the map comes in handy look at that you really just run straight after that room what no way I need to make it so balking shows up on the on the chat preview I don't know when that's from. I think it's from a few days ago. I think it was when I was talking about... Uh... God, I don't even remember. It's from a couple streams ago. It's the enemy. I need a help. was that thank you abra i'm gonna kick this cheerful sandwich ah! you guys see that pyramid thing there that's fucked god what room is this for i think it's this way No, it actually has a range controls like RE1 Remake. You can make it have tank controls though, sort of. This is not the room. I don't think this is the way. I'm bad. And I should feel bad. everybody
Yeah, for those who don't know, we were talking about scary games earlier since it's a horror marathon. Ooh. Uh, my menu button should. Um. So. Um, when this game came out, it was like a lot of people consider it like the scariest game ever made by far, like terrifying. Do not play this. Pretty funny to think back on. You guys remember? But um You will poop all over your key. No. That Rosso. Also when I was a kid, I remember the movie that was notorious for being like really scary was um Pet Cemetery. At least where I grew up. I can't remember anything about the remake. Was it bad? Shut! Yeah, I like Texas Chance. You mean the newest one? That movie was... <whistles> P.U. Thank you. The newest one was oopy doopy. Oopy poopy. Look up the fucking thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Leatherface got canceled in that movie. Forgot about that. Wait a sec. I think it's the second floor. Speedrunner doesn't know where he's going. I don't run this game, though. I actually don't run this game. I did like one day of runs back a long ass time ago. In a Silent Hill far, far away. Uh. 
Uh, does anyone know the order of the coins in this puzzle? Because I sure don't. Anyone? Please tell me. It's on easy, the puzzles. Maybe I'll just do the puzzle, I guess. Might take a bit, though. Do, 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 do. Any helpers? Any helpers? I think it's like... Okay, to the right is the lady. Wait, what? Is it that easy? Holy shit. Augers. I hope there's a... I hope it lets you choose riddle difficulty. Oh, the remake. I can't wait. Bloober team is gonna knock it out of the bloob. Classic Bloober team just nailing it. They've never made a bad game. I'm bloobing off! Look at James's face. Scram! Hey, dipshit! Squidward, yeah. Bloober team. Yeah, my god, that flex. Bloober team is just gonna release it the day after RE4 remake. And the sales are gonna quadruple it. Like, people are just gonna forget about RE4 remake in like 12 hours after release. Ultimate Giga Chad move. Yeah, I think this game has one of the best lines in any video game. Yeah, God, Capcom is probably shaking in their boots right now. The Capcom. Come on, lady. Yeah, I'm trying to reset my schedule. I'd like to start my streams like now and then end them eight hours from now or whatever. But, um, yeah. Schedule's a little fucked at the moment. The timer says seven hours, but I've been streaming for nine. Wait, can we do dog ending? I. I haven't done it in like forever. Oh, <gasps> it's here! Wait, what else do you need? Just the dog key? I haven't done dog ending in like actually like over a year. You just need the key, that's it? Oh hell yeah, dude. I have not done this in so long. But, um, God, I love the sound effects in Silent Hill. 
Uh, you know what? I, I am really excited for the remake. I do think there's a good chance they're going to frig it up, but I hope not. How can you just sit there and eat pizza? Did you find the lady you're looking for? What's her name? Mary? The speedrun for Silent Hill 2 is bittersweet, because you don't get all the best stuff. The music, the cutscenes. You just get the running. It's all good, though. We got to hear that bop for a sec. And it was bopping. If Saddle 2 doesn't have live up to live, but I still have hope for the projects. Yeah, I mean. If they release them, I'll buy them. Love supporting Konami. Best song. Take away that true events there. Take away the was based on true events in that sentence quick. And retype it. Yeah, there we go. I also like how Silent Hill 2 is based. I don't know where to go. I always get lost in the hospital playing on this cricket playing this freaking game. Like I always get lost. Move. No, no, not this. What what floor do you go to first? Two or three? No, no one knows. Shit. Well, I'm going to two. I don't know either. I actually don't know. I just, I do, I just fucking YOLO it every time. Ow, it pricked me. Yeah, Silent Hill 3 I know. What's the password here? Does anyone know? Shit. Okay, what's this? 6929. Okay, I think we go up now. What's the pass? Wait, someone please tell me the password for the third floor. Anyone? Fuck, what is it? I'll just... Uh, 7335, is that true? That sounds true-ish. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Alpha. Woohoo! A hero in the chat. A hero. Hero. Tablox is a hero. Oh. You're both heroes. <laughs> Wait, I'm, I think I'm missing a key. Shit, guys, I, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Is six nine? Six two six two. I don't know. I think we need two keys, don't we? Right? We, we definitely do. The fuck is the other one? Yeah, where the heck is that lapis eye key? I have no clue. I actually don't know. It's not up here. It's not. It's got to be on the other floor. I think it's at the end of the other floor. Pretty sure it's like, like near the end of this hallway. God damn it, I'm so bad at this game. Need a hero to save me. There it is. 
I followed my senses. It's a shotgun? All of my senses, people. We're doing it, chat. We're doing it. Excuse me, lady. Nice drawers. Nice legs. Ah! What was the other one? Oh, fuck. Uh, thank you, Dimash, for the 84. Thank you. Thank you so much for the 84 months. Look at that, Riso. Holy shit. It's the old man chicken's gonna come out soon. Hi, Enigma. Thank you, sir, for the raid. Welcome, everybody. I'm playing Silent Hill 2 very badly. I don't even know what the hell I'm doing. Dude, thank you so much. Welcome, everyone. Uh, how was your stream, Enigma? What were you up to? Move it, lady. It's all very stressful because I don't know how to speedrun this game, but I knew the people wanted it, so I had to play it. What? Cauldron? Uh, oh, Children of Silent Town? Hell yeah. Oh my god, where are we? What did I even just pick up? Welcome everyone, make sure to follow Internal Enigma, an amazing streamer! And person, may I add. Yeah, what have you been up to lately? You've been playing. You don't need to tell me if you're tired. You know, he might already be gone. That's all good. It's all good. It's all good. And Reliever, thank you so much for the 15 months. Nice to see you both. Thank you, thank you. I apologize for my performance, guys. I'm really bad at Silent Hill 2. I don't even know how to aim. Or shoot. It's on nightmare mode, by the way. You gotta believe me. Oh no, oh yeah, I can't wait for Dead Space. I'm super pumped. Names! Aim at him. We got him. We got him. It's time for me to get lost again. Uh. Okay, um. I think you go in a room down here for some reason. No, you don't. Uh, three. And... Thank you. I hope your stream went very well. The speedrunner is getting lost. Dude. Okay, you know what? I don't think we're on the right floor. Jeez. Holy crap, you're up late. Sorry, my brain's all fucked on time right now, so I didn't even put the two together. What's this key for? Oh, okay, here we go. Now I know what to do. Now we go to the other floor, then we go to the basement, then we come back up. Then we scup. God, if I heard the locked door sound effect there. Woo. So 
So, you guys from Enigma Stream, was it fun? James. Yeah. Was it fun, guys? Meh. Yeah. Shit. Damn. Come on, guys. Yeah, there we go. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Fuck yeah. Enigma, we need an Enigma ing emote for 7TV. Guys, who's with me? You're next, Enigma. Thank you, Reliever. The gift it's up to fun stream. Bum 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 ba dum. Bum 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 ba dum. God, I. My movement here is always scumpy. Come on, girl! Wait, why is she getting wrecked? Thank you, big titty goth mom, for the four months. Hell yeah. In the kind words. Who's excited to see me get lost again? Yeah, I'm trying to reset my schedule. What? Oh, yeah. Bye, Maria. I know. There should be a Silent Hill, Resident Evil, and Dino Crisis crossover. Play with You play as Heather, Regina, and Jill. Versus zombie dinosaurs in Silent Hill. Who's with me? I'm just gonna go. Th I'm just gonna follow my fucking nose here. I don't know where the hell I'm going. I think it's this way. And then there's like a car parked here that you cut through. Maybe. I think. There might be two cars though. Oh no, where's the car? Oh shit, did I already go the wrong direction? Is this the wrong way? I think it is. Hello? Recognize any of this? Oh, there's the car! We did it. Game saved. Game saved. Oh yeah, Bluber's gonna nail it. Bluber has not made a bad game. I'm a little nervous for Bloober doing gameplay for once, but I mean, whatever. You know, at face value, the trailer makes the game look really good. So, hopefully it'll be good. Thank you, Bodster. I just, the only thing I'm concerned about is the, is the gameplay. Show me the gameplay. Even though that should be the least of our concerns with this game, it isn't the least of my concerns.
Regardless, I'm just excited to play a fucking Silent Hill game for once. A new one. Uh. Okay, now I don't know what way to turn. I think you just go back. Or something. Ah. Uh, maybe you go up Nelly Street? Oh, yeah, you go to the apartments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to use the map. I'm- I apologize. Oof, imagine. I was saying earlier, the trailers sort of make it seem like it's gonna play like a Batman game where you just- Or Spider-Man or whatever, where you just press the- You press the action button and it just hits anything around you like a magnet. I really hope it doesn't play like that. I hope it's janky. Hey, Serbian. Seeing a lot of people coming to chat for the second time tonight. A lot of people sleep six hours here? Um. Yo, Cartlet. Yeah, I slept like four yesterday. That's why I waited to stream after I slept again. All right, is it left or right here? I can never fucking remember, dude. Oh, it's gotta be right. It's gotta be. Oh yeah, I never put those things together, but for the people that are always here like three times a stream and like, oh, I slept, I'm back. Yeah, I forgot kids destroy your schedule. Not that everyone that's doing that has a kid, but if you do. Wah, wah, wah. Oops. Thank you. Oh, wow. Glad I can give you a distraction. Oh, shit. Not this way. I'm so happy we're actually going through the game relatively quickly. I thought this would take like two to three hours, but I think we'll be able to beat it in like an hour and a half-ish. Ish. Ish. Mm -hmm. And then Granny 3, baby. Yeah, Celestial, I... God, I wish I could just stream all hours. I wish I didn't have to sleep. Wouldn't that be sick? Oh, uh, what is one thing they should keep in the remake from this game? Keep in? Besides Pyramid Head? Uh... I, well, okay, well, I don't know how to answer that, but I, one thing I would like them to expand upon heavily, one thing I really enjoy about Downpour and Origins, and it's in this game too, in Silent Hill 1 and 3, but I like exploring random places in Silent Hill. I want more stuff, I want more buildings to go into and see some extra lore or just little things here and there to look at. And really, like, th this game also has some pretty cool random rooms and stuff. But it'd be, it'd be fun to just visit areas from other Silent Hill games as well. Maybe not fully explore them, but at least let them be there so we can see them. And then in another future game, like if they remake one or two or whatever, you see them again 
um, but explore them more thoroughly because they're actually a location meant to be explored within the pro the um, respective game. Yeah, Happy Burger. There's so many places in Silent Hill, like even in Silent Hill 3 especially, uh, where you look at an area and you just can't go in. It's just like, oh man. It's one thing I really liked about Downpour. I thought the exploration was really fun. Not that that's a good game, but, you know, I think there's good things in that game. They generally have some ideas down pretty well, and then just fucking, the gameplay is always a disaster. Are there any downpour enjoyers in the chat? Uh... Uh... Enigma loves downpour. Nice. Oops. <laughs> the last one. Mm -hmm. So many runs I've done of this in the past <laughs> with the suitcase. Uh, I always get really, really bad ones. And I was also very bad at inputting them. I hate that the things I'm usually worst at in speedruns are the like really weird things that have nothing to do with the gameplay. For example, in in Resident Evil 2 Remake, it's those fucking medallions. Those RPD medallions. Oh my god. My churro. I went the wrong way. My churro. Did you guys know that's what he's saying? My churro. Man loves his churros. The hell is this room? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Lighter? There another pl Oh my god, I forgot. <laughs> Got to have a bathroom scare in Silent Hill. Is it even a Silent Hill game if you don't? Oh, shower. Heck. <laughs> Clicky clicky. Uh, I think it's this way. It's not. Here it is. My churro. Say the line. Yeah, don't call them Bloober Team, call them Giga Chad Team.
you. Someone got their wiener pulled a little too hard. Imagine that. Do not put your- I'm just giving you guys some advice. Do not put your wiener in the wrong hands. Holy shit. All you gotta do, all you have to do is give that thing a big tug real hard. Oh, that thing would just come right off. Wouldn't it? Damn, dude. That's gotta happen in a horror movie. Like Evil Dead Rises. Like take a flaccid wiener and just pull as hard as you can and rip it right out of the stem. Like you're uprooting a plant. You'd make a good kill. Does that happen in VHS? But it's gotta show it graphically. That Missed opportunity in Terrifier 2. Thank you, Rami. joshing it could be holy as well oh I've seen teeth vagina dentata that's what it's called in the movie by the way I'm not just saying gross stuff you guys are here for stuff like that, so don't blame me. Oh, nice. Yeah, man, I really hope everyone can experience an Outbreak remake in their life so you get to see those moments. Whoosh. You know, Terrifier 2 is actually pretty uh, toned down for what I was expecting based off all the hype. Same with Incantation. I watched Incantation because everyone said it was like the most messed up movie ever, but it was pretty tame, I think. It, was, it wasn't no murders. Look at him run! Uh, I don't know, Shane. That's a tough question. That was a hard watch. I can't even remember Murders, really. I just remember watching it like years ago and thinking it was disgusting. Yeah, you know what? I actually liked T Terrifier 2, but I also think it was too long. That last sequence could have been like 15 minutes shorter. Daddy, please don't. Let's go, James. We have the chainsaw. We're gonna come here, you. Get what's coming to you. Got him. Daddy, please don't. All right, YOLO. Did we get the YOLO? No. 
We'll get it. We'll get it. Excuse me. Try right, this one. Hello? Oh. What's worse than murders? Uh, I'm trying to think of the most disgusting horror movie. Um. Uh. I haven't watched Serbian film because just. That's the one, the controversial one, right? 13 cameras? Oh, I've seen that movie. That movie's terrible. I watched. There's a second one too, I think. I can't remember much of 13 cameras. Maybe names. Yeah, you know what? Honestly, Human Centipede is a pretty well known one, but it is fucking disgusting. That is a. Oops. Society! Hey, that's a good- that's a good pick. The last 15 minutes of society are like the grossest thing ever. But, you know, it's- it's gross in a different way. It's not gross in like a- like a... You know. I'm not gonna spoil it. Oh my god, did we just get the last one? I don't plan on watching Serbian film or... I've also never watched, uh... Um... Uh, Cannibal Holocaust, or whatever it's called. Those two movies I just don't want to watch. Oh, God. Slaughtered Vomit Dolls. That sounds more like a metal band than a movie. Or a death metal band. What? Wait, my crate is this just a really bad hitbox? Rolling around at the speed of sound. You know, I don't really like the super, super grotesque movies, usually. Thank you, Big Louie. It just depends if there's more to it than the, the, like, gore. Like, I thought, I felt like in Terrifier 2 there was more to it, like I was interested in the other stuff going on. But something like Hostel, for example, is just like... You know. Yeah, Murders was just like, uh There was another movie about four people in a room getting tortured by a guy. I can't remember what that was called. Shit. Ow! Come here, you! There he goes. Look at him run. What? What is that one called? No, I watched it recently. Um, it was on Netflix, I think. It's your favorite horror film? Murders? What do you consider bad then, Miss Sugar? Maybe it's called Green Room? It's like a guy gets captured in the first like 10 minutes and then the rest of the movie is just in a freaking room getting tortured with three other people all chained to opposite squares of the wall. I don't know if I've seen Hell House. I didn't watch funny games. Maybe it, I think Captivity might be it. House of Wax. House of Yikes. 
Grave Encounters, yeah, that's the ghost hunting one. That one was good. Or it was decent. Hell wow, everyone has seen Hell House. What the heck? Is it newish? I don't know what the hell you guys are talking about. We have to search that up. I, I, every, but I do this often where I'm like, oh, I don't know what you guys are talking about. I'm going to search it and I search and I'm like, oh, I've seen this. Wait, ABCs of Death, I think, has a wiener pulling scene. Doesn't it? Or someone gets their wiener, like, something happens to their wiener. Dude, ABCs of Death is uh, decent entertainment, but didn't think it was that great. Oh, I just watched that stream. Wait, what, Hell House, is that newish? Thank you, Wonky Donkey, for the 54. Doo doo. Something over here. Um, is that like, oh, it's a few years old. Yo, bro, Riggs. Yeah, I gotta see it. Dude, I wish our theater was open. I really want to watch. What the fuck am I doing? I gotta remember, guys. I really don't know. Uh... I wish, I wish our theater was open. I want to watch, uh, what's her name? Yeah, I don't know much about, wait, wait, I know where to go. Oops. Okay, guys, place your bets. What do you think it's going to be this way? Megan, yeah. Place your bets, guys. It's one out of 19 chance. Hey, guys that make fun of Elden Ring because it reused bosses. Why does Silent Hill get a pass? Ooh, got him. It's actually pretty... You know what? It's it's actually pretty sad that they reused that enemy, like, instantly. I never really put much thought into it, but... Null, no. Down. There's something else that starts at the end. Okay, uh, this is like playing Wordle. All right, one in 19 chance, by the way. Um, shit. Lose. Can't be milk. Luck? Yep. Keep naming them, guys. I don't remember all of them. I'm so slow at this. Not luck. Lore? Is that one? Uh, lock. Oh, okay. Next letter. Kill. No. Uh, okay, down, dose. Damn it. Uh, dark. Yep. Oh, uh, dark. Is dead one? Oh, it is. Uh, what are the T's? Town? Uh, take.
No. I haven't. Time. Oh yeah, I didn't do dust. Or damn. Uh, oh, what are the O's? Open? Shit. Uh, uh, over. Oh my god. Yeah, time. I don't think I did time. We've tried a lot of them. <laughs> Oh my god, any second now. Mama is one, I think, actually. Oh, evil. Yeah, that's one of them. No, it's not, actually. Derp. Um. What one did I not try? Oh yeah, we didn't try hell. Shit. Nope. Help. Nope. Um, there's only a couple left, I think. This fast is most. Mist might be. I think it is. Yeah. We got it. <laughs> ah. The Mist. Yeah, I like that movie. Ending. Yeah, a lot of people didn't like it. I like a bad ending. Now and every now and then. The Mist series. There's a show. Skeleton key ending. I haven't watched that in a long time. Oops. Oh yeah, this room you don't need to go in. Yeah, Skeletal Key was scary when it came out. Excuse me. Dark Darkness Falls. That's the... Shit, I can't remember if I'm getting that confused with something else. Is that the vampire one in Alaska? Oh, that's the Tooth Fairy one. Yeah, I've seen that. I just can't remember anything from it. Yeah, I was thinking of 30 Days a Night. I actually watched that semi-recently.
We're getting dog ending, by the way. I haven't got this ending in a long time. By the way, if you want the actual answer to that thing we did, you just grab this and you go use it right beside the briefcase and it tells you the answer. But in the speed run, you guess it. Actually, in the speed run, in the current route, I don't even think you go in that room because you go out of bounds. Maybe, I don't know exactly. Is this really a horror game? Nah. See guys? Fucking everyone says that about every game. That's why I put no thought into it, because even people say is Silent Hill a horror game and it's renowned to be the best horror game ever made. <laughs> nope, yeah. What? When the last one is returned? Wait, wait, what did that say? Oh, 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 you don't even have to, like, I forgot. Hard mode. Hard mode puzzles. Great puzzle. On hard. Shit, I don't even take the fucking thing from the... Ugh. This tape, we're just going to skip it. It doesn't mean much. All right, ending time, people. Hell yeah, dude. Everyone get ready to dance. Oh. I haven't got this ending in ye years. He's angry at the dog killer. bathroom and then it's time for our final game granny three
Ah, okay. Look at that boat max speed. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah, dude. All right. The critics acclaim series, Granny. Everybody give it up for Granny 3. Last played November. Wait, why won't it show? Oh no, it's doing that thing again where it doesn't want to show up. One sec. We're gonna have to do monitor capture, one second. All right, can you see it? All right, people. Let's do this. <sighs> Granny three. Oh, all right. Don't trust that timer though. I've been live for 10 hours, not eight. Why normal? Well, I would play easy because, but, um, Normal is just more interesting than easy. Oh, nice. Nothing in there. Yikes. Because hard is very slow. Like, here's the difference between normal and hard. Oh my god, dude. Getting fucked on all sides here. Extreme mode or hard mode is super RNG. So your typical plate is going to be like an hour long. Ugh. Yeah, everyone was there. Holy shit. Get away from me, granny. You still coming? We got the coconut. I guess. <laughs> we got the coconut. Thank you, Mizzy. Thank you. Coming down. Oh shit. Don't go into the water. I've never seen that happen. Uh, will that respawn? Well, huh. uh, but, um, oh shit, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I I've beaten Granny 
the granny games on extreme mode, like the hardest difficulty. It, it, it unfortunately revolves around waiting in lockers for like 95% of the time. Unless you reset for best luck. I wonder what a... I've never watched a Granny Extreme speedrun, though. I wonder what it's like. She, oh my god, dude! Please! Why am I getting fucked so hard? Leave me alone, dude. Oh, okay. This is for outside. Let's see if the, the freaking coconut's here. Of course. Granny doesn't want the stream to end, yeah. Alright. Look at Grandpa. Watch him snipe me! Oh my god. Why do I end the streams with Granny? Please give me that from here. God damn it, dude. Why is it down to this shit here? Get out of here, Grandpa, you fuck. The hell is Granny? Please don't be up here. He's around here. Is she camping right where I need to go? Oh boy. I made a sound. Here comes Granny. Oh, look what it is. All that work for this shit. Ugh. Grandpa, you better not be out here. Alright. Thank you, Abra. We're a family. Wait. Shit. Um, you guys need to go... We were talking about horror movies earlier. You guys need to go watch Stepfather. There's, there's three of them. Or there's four, actually, because there's a remake. No! Oh shit, what am I doing? Oh! Okay, can I make it? Can I make it? I forgot about the... Patty. Shit! Okay, okay. Oh, you did after I mentioned it? And did you love it? It's not a good movie, but... Did you love it though? Oh my god, it's like ear piercing. Hi, Slendrina! Slendrina is now gone. Dude, this is actually shit. Where are you? What up, Granny? Got her. Wait, that's not shit, though. Oh, where the hell's Grandpa, dude? You better not... Dude, just let me go get the freaking gun. Please, Grandpa, don't be here. They're both right here. You gotta be fucked! Well, I guess while we're out here, we can get some stones. Thought I seen one. There's one. It's Grandpa. Give me it! She lost me. Wait, wait. Come on. Where are you, piece of shit? Got her. <sighs> Granny's about to get fucked.
go. Where's Grampy? Oh, there he is. Come on. Don't see me, don't see me. Oh no! How... Wait, why did it drop something? It better not, she better not be sprinting towards me. God damn it, dude. Well, we, we kept our rocks, at least. Oh my god. That was reckless of me to just run by Grandpa. But, but he misses a lot of the time. Dude, where is he? Okay, are they gone? Okay, where the fuck's Grandpa, dude? Well, I guess let's go try and get into his room. Because the, the... Alright. Okay, okay. Come on, don't cut us off. You know what? We don't have to down them yet. I could just get the uh, the vases first. All right. Man of the house, yeah. Now we need to knock out Grandpa, wherever he is. I see you. Do you? Hey, Tuna. Yeah. Good morning, everybody. Uh, who's just Who's just waking up in the chat? Who's just waking up? 9:38 my time. Early stream. I've been live for 10 hours. I started at the most degen time possible. I'm on, Boner Champ. I'm on. Thank you, Forza. LOL. God, where the hell are they, dude? Oh yeah, it's completely fucked. Uh, Cosmic. I'm really, really trying to get back on a morning schedule. Cause like, I was on one, and then I had to fucking... I had to... Uh... Where the hell is she? I had shit I had to do and then... Yikes, it got ruined. Oh, we can go kill the bird with this, actually. Everybody, don't look. I like how he looks at you. Uh, please don't go all the way down. Hey! Don't worry, he's not... He has nothing to do with the chicken family. It's all good. Okay, now we gotta kill Grandpa and Grandma. Quickly. Let's just wait for them. They're, they should be uh, awake soon. Granny?
Nice wiener. Got her. Grandpa! Please be right here. Please be right here. Please be right here. There he is. Alright, um, now the vase. The vases take so fucking long. Where did I put that padlock key, actually? I need that padlock key. Alright. Where the hell did I put that? I put it in another thing. All right. Um Hi, did I put it? I put it in another shit. I need to find it. Like I actually need it. Damn it. What the hell is it? Ah. Use. Does anyone remember where I put it? Oh wait, I put it in here. It's actually in here. I remember now. Right over here. There it is. Oh, they're both here, I think. Come on, Granny! Go, 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 go. If you have enough time for two rounds, but for well, let's hope they don't spawn right in front of me. Yeah, we do have the, um, we do have the padlock key. Or no, no, sorry. Wait, I don't know what I'm trying to say. No ammo. Come on, Grandma! I hear him. Where is he? The hell is he? Up here? I don't hear him anymore, though. Grandpa! Let's just get some rocks, I guess. Thank you, Jay, Trev. Beep boop. Grandpa stalling, yeah. Bullshit. Grandpa? I think I need to wait till grandma comes back now. Unless he's like right here-ish.
He was just going to sit on the porch. Oh, of course she's back. Nice. We'll put that here. What? That's not supposed to make noise. Oh, uh, whoa, shit. We have the train key. We need the lever. And we have the fuse here. The train is actually a good ending. Um, uh, so we need bullets. Wait, I need to go get shotgun ammo, but I need to kill Grandpa. And where the hell's the shotgun? Maybe he won't be around. Let's just start, grab it. Wait, where's the freaking ammo? Oh. Oh no, this I'm setting myself up for getting fucked. Over here. Uh. Come on. We need to find Granny. She's probably around here somewhere, buddy. There she is. Her husband! Damn it, dude. Where'd I put this slingshot? I don't remember. Well, that's okay. We don't need it. Uh, Granny 1 got a huge update, but it's only for mobile at the moment. Where the hell is the slingshot? There is an update, yep. Yeah. I'm Granny's biggest fan, how... Oh, here it is. Thank you, Hickey, for the two months. Thank you. Ah, okay. Granny. Oh, look at the look at look at this. The perfect couple. Oh, 
Double kill. Get fucked. I might have the most granny playtime on Twitch. Sorry, I'll go get my ticket. Oh no, we still need one more thing. Oh yeah, actually, you know what's funny? I think, so I've been playing this game for like five years. I think Dist passed me in playtime during his like two week romper with Granny One. That's all it took. It took Dist two weeks to pass my like five years. I'm pretty sure. I think he put like a hundred of showers in. I don't have a hundred hours in this game. Um, I don't think I do. Wait, let's see. I have 13 in Granny 3. Uh, wait, what's left? Yeah, he was addicted. I mean, I could get the other ending, but the train one's so much better. Uh, we still need an item though. Maybe it's in the, um, is there an item in the train? Wait, what do we miss? I actually can't think of what we're missing. Uh... Just this. I have grannies to kill, one sec. I think I did. No, it's just that. I heard him, I think. Where is he? He needed to die! Uh, uh, where's the coinage? Okay, it's probably downstairs. Wait, there it is! Go, go, go. Is there any games out on Unreal 5 yet? Or no? It's not done yet? Or... What? Why? Look, I got my ticket. I got my ticket. Let's blow this joint. Shall we? Slendrina. <laughs> Granny has everything. Thank you, Rarlarius, for the 69. Nices in the chat. Thank you. Shoot that gun, Grandpa. <laughs> no, I didn't see the strawberry. Oh, that's what you guys are talking about. Sorry, it's hard to pay attention to the strawberry candies that every every Granny has. Where is the update? Does it talk about it on Steam? 
No, this is an old one. Oh my god, it's loud as shit. Stop it, Grandpa. Oh, short marathon. Yeah, it's been 10 hours. Yeah, nice. Thank you so much, Rylarius, for the big 6-9. Thank you. All right, I am tired, guys. It's been a long marathon, 10 hours. Holy shit.